41,000 for giving out five gift subs. Thank you very much. Um, Scoutmaster Chris used their Twitch Prime. Thank you. Uh, Zubal Dude gave out five gift subs as well. So many gift subs. You, you made a level five hype train before I even started. Can you believe it? Thank you, Sputnik Kitty, cheering 100 bits. Appreciate that. Um, Ren Nettle used their Prime. Thank you. Wolflord Lewis resubbed for 13 months. Wolflord Lewis, holy fuck moly. So ben, how are you? I'm all right. I'm, I'm a bit achy. My ribs still haven't healed. Um, but I'm all right. I can't can't complain. Um, Walrus also resubs for 13 months. And he says, uh, I'm sure nothing bad will happen to my chump today. Oh, 13. You're right. This is the day everyone's chumps die. 13 months. It's the cursed sub month. But don't worry. We'll just bust through. We'll get to 14 and everything will be okay. Um, Fipsy also resubbed 13 months. Thank you, Fipsy. Um, Faith is our shield. Well, so Vospender. Vospender gave out three gift subs. Thank you, Vospender. Um, Al, Ran Al Rangor gave out five gift subs. Thank you, Al Rangor. My God, so many gift subs today. Is it Faith special? Is, is it a special gift sub day? I don't know. Uh, Bryony just raided. Hey, Bryony, how you doing? Thanks you. Thank you for the raid. I thought. Everyone was going to raid um, the Daltos Left for Dead stream. Is that, is that not on? I thought they were doing something special on the main channel. But I guess not, because everyone's raiding me instead. Which, I, which is very kind. Thank you. Um, thank you, Tucker. Thank you, Tandy. Thank you, Ghost Point. Thank you, uh, Chuck Thanks HNA. Thank you, uh, Dark Vamp. Thank you, uh, Nahili. All for, the, all for the subs. So many resubs today. It's very kind. Um, and thank you, Walrus, for giving out another gift sub too. Whew. Why are my ribs Faith sore? Um, I came off my bike. I wasn't even going very fast. I managed to like break really hard. Um, and then when I when I came off the bike, my elbow like slammed into my ribs. Um, and it's it was about two weeks ago now, and it's just been Faith really really shield. painful. I think I like quite seriously bruised them. And the problem is your ribs just never really get a chance to heal because just breathing and moving and twisting really just hurts them. So it's been it's been horrible actually trying to sleep. I wake up in the night because I'll roll over in the night and then I get this jabbing pain in my chest just from rolling over. So I've had bad sleeps, sad times, but it's a lot it's a lot better than it was. It's been like two weeks, so I think I think I've probably got another week or so before it will like wear off. Hopefully. Um Oh my goodness. Karashenko just gave out twenty gift subs. Is it is it gift sub an idiot day today or something? Like what what are you guys doing? It's so generous. Thank you, everyone. You absolute mad lads. Take Holy me moly. Um, tr uh, Truinings. Truinings? Is that how I pronounce it? Also gave out five gift subs. There's so many subs. I don't understand, but I, I love it. You can love something you don't understand. They want you to get that Optimus Prime model. <laughs> Is that what it is? Is this the GoFundMe Optimus Prime? <laughs> Faith is our shield. Thank you. <laughs> oh my god. Well, I mean, maybe I can. That was so many gift subs. I'll have to add it up afterwards. Maybe that's how I justify it. When the wife asks, why did you spend $800 on a toy? Um... I'll just say, well, I had to. That's, I mean, Twitch chat. They they, o they said they would only give out the subs if I bought the toy. It's not my fault. It'd be Thank rude not to. Be rude not to, wouldn't it? <laughs> chat made me do it. <laughs> Primes for Prime. <laughs> I love that. A good one, I did again. Oh. <laughs> they, they insisted. They Faith did. Is our shield. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, maybe maybe the dream is real. <laughs> oh, guys, <laughs> you really don't have to. <laughs> but thank you, Tyres HTML, also giving out five gift subs. Take me into Ooh, battle. Quentin Quentin Lamora used their Twitch Prime. Um, thank you very much. Um, Sunburn Orc also gave out a, a Twitch Prime. <laughs> Symptomous Prime. <laughs> oh, my, oh my God, guys, it's so Thanks many. It's so shit. many. What is this? Dark Kip just gave out 20 gift subs. Oh my god. Thank you, everyone. There's so many gift subs today. Lewis's was his weekly gift sub that he does. I know. Thank you, Wolf Lord Lewis. Thank I always notice and, and 
appreciate that. Um, Night Raven Twenty One Z. He's he's their prime. Oh my god. Well, I don't know if everyone here saw it, but last last night Tom and I saw this advert Faith for a new Optimus Prime toy. And I guess now that we're talking about it, I kind of have to show it to everyone who hasn't seen it. Um, let's have a look. Faith um, is our shield. Optimus Prime. Hopefully it hasn't sold out yet. The limited edition ridiculous Optimus Prime they just announced like a week ago. Um here it is. Uh is our shield. So we'll skip the Auto converting, interactive, voice enabled for Look at that. Isn't it ridiculous? Optimus Prime. He literally the Transformers transforms by itself. Comes to life it's got by like a remote control. Goal. Like you can use your app to like make it do stuff. It's absurd. It's like the most over-engineered, insane thing in the world. Um, it's 19 Great. inches it's tall. It, it has voice lines from Peter Cullen recorded on it. It responds. It's like voice activated. You tell it to transform and it does. It's ridiculous and incredibly expensive, but also amazingly cool. Um, so that's, that's what we were talking about yesterday. The walking's not as cool. That's probably the least cool part of it, the weird little hobbling he does. <laughs> but you could make him dab if you wanted to, I guess. Like, with its animation settings. This limited edition Optimus Prime delivers endless ability to save the planet interactively. Till all are one. So yeah, that, that's what we were talking about for anyone who missed it. Um... <laughs> yeah, bipedal walking is, is pretty impossible to get right. You're not wrong about that. <laughs> what about stroll out? <laughs> oh. oh my god. Voss Bender gave out five gift subs as well. Faith is oh my goodness. Thank you. Can we get it to say, my face is my shield? <laughs> well, I guess we have to now. Actually, that's a good point. We'll just mute the, um, the hundred... That... that Faces my shield on repeat a hundred times. I'm just going to mute it for a bit now because um, I think you've heard it enough. Um, Dr. Simon Clark got in trouble with his significant other when apparently he brought a Tyranid model for £120 when chat donated to have him paint it on stream. And by trouble, I mean she got confused about the purchase and asked him about it. <laughs> That's fair enough. You know, if, um, if my significant other spent £120, I'd, I'd be like, what? what was that? Why why did that come out of our bank? Is it a limited edition run? I think it is a limited edition run, yeah. Um It's eight hundred dollars. No, seven hundred dollars, sorry. Which is an insane amount of money for a toy. And I have no idea how many How many they have. Oh, it's oh my god, is it already sold out? The first wave has already sold out, and you can put in your email address to like Find out about the second run. Oh dear. Well, notify me immediately. That didn't take very long to go. An email will be sent to you when it's back in stock. Boo! Oh, that's made me sad. But surely if it sells out in day. They'll do another batch, won't they? I'd be mad not to. Colony tour. Yeah, we could do a colony tour. There's probably a bunch of people that came in the raid that haven't seen where we're at with the with the colony. Um, yeah, a little nighttime tour while everyone's sleeping. So welcome to the Rimward stream. We're a few streams in, but we're not super deep into the game yet. We've, uh, but we've lost a lot of people. We started with 11, and we've probably recruited, like, 
I don't know, six or seven or eight people on top of that. When we'd, but we've only got eight left. Um, people keep dying. It's been pretty brutal. So, um, who have we got? We got um, KV. It's a pacifist. He's loving Izzy. He's lost half his brain. Don't worry about that. Um, he's our cook and doctor. That's his job. Um, cool Jedi's here. He's a good fighter and a backup medic. And he's like okay at mining. He's also a wimp, which is a really bad combination to have with melee. Um, and he's lost an arm. So I guess not that much of a wimp. Um, we've got Izzy, who's like a, a tech priest, covered in bionic implants, including the love enhancer. Oh my. And the aesthetic shaper. Ooh. They can change any part of their body to look like any other part. I think KV just can have whatever wild tentacle fantasies they have fulfilled every night. Uh, we've got Alpha Cat. He's also got like a bionic arm and a bionic stomach. Um, and he's actually pretty good. Very good fighter. Good at mining. But the problem with Alpha Cat is they have permanent brain damage. Um, I, they got their brain mangled by an orc shooter. Which has basically meant they're 50% at everything now. They're slow. They're stupid. They've got fat fingers. Um... It's bad. It's bad. If we ever find any, like, healing item, we need to use it on Alpha Cat because they're just, like, a bit of a drain in the economy right now. Um, the smoothest of brains. Someone ironed Alpha Cat's brain, unfortunately. Uh, we've got Kurashishi, who's doing great. It's a good shot. Uh, likes animals and crafting. It's sounding like a dating website now, isn't it, the way I'm saying it? Uh, but they've also got the charge rifle, which is pretty cool. Uh, Kurashishi, very good. Just good old, reliable, no injuries pristine condition um we got walrus who's just like an average bod but pretty good at crafting actually walrus that's good we need that that's how we're going to develop as a colony um got a bionic leg and a missing a hand which is not ideal hard to craft stuff with one hand so we are actually researching bionics right now because we've got two people missing arms um so we'll get on that get on that pretty soon we've got crimson um crimson is an intellectual anime lover um, and they basically are ch head researcher since our last researcher died um, and they've got the psychic reader installed which means they're really good at negotiating prices they're like our chief negotiator because they they can find out if the other person's like haggling or bluffing um, how many people are on the wheel now well I guess after all those gift subs the wheel's pretty big oh my god it's hat films how you doing, Hat Films? Thank you for the raid. That is awesome. What were you guys playing? Welcome. Well, I, you've literally you just missed the intro. <laughs> just bad timing. I just went through and explained what was happening in the colony. But we can do another like super quick recap. Are you doing a Rocket League tournament? Oh man, you didn't invite me because you were too afraid. <laughs> That's that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. Oh, man. How did you do? Was it good? Did you win? I'm just, I'm just too good at the game. What can I say? <laughs> Trot won. What? Well, you weren't a team. What the hell? Ah, oh, you're winning, Hut. As 1v1s with randoms. Ah, Trot lost the final. She. Well, good luck. well done getting to the final, though. That's cool. Well, with randos from chat. 1v1 Rocket League is like a totally different kettle of fish, I imagine. I mean, I've never tried it, but... Trot beat casual? What? Holy moly. Is that true? Is that, is that fake chat? Is that, is that your chat? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, well, thanks for coming by, guys. Thanks for the raid. Um, so we're doing RimWorld. We're playing with 40k mods. Uh, we're playing like an Imperial Guard outpost. We've got a tech priest here who um, has got a cyber dong for banging. It's called a love enhancer. Don't worry about it. Um, and we've got like seven other spods with gas masks on. We've lost a lot of people. Things have got a bit ropey. But we're living. We're surviving. 
We had an orc raid. We've we, we've got this. Oh no, we actually had a goat raid. Apparently, got attacked by wild goats. This is the kill box. You're going to get very familiar with this kill box. Um, the barbed wire and the heavy bolter emplacements. If this falls, we die. Um, and the way that it works is everything in the game is named after people who've like donated and subscribed. Um, anyone who doesn't get something named after them goes into um, like a document at the end of the stream. And then the following week, that gets put into the game like with a mod. And then randoms who turn up are selected from that game. So hopefully every other person we like chat to or bandits that attack will be named after everyone from last week. Which is really fun. And it takes all the automation out of my hands, which is perfect. Um, is a cyberdom like a Bitcoin? <laughs> oh, could I give you some advice on a mini you painted? Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, you'll have to let a mod like allow you to p post a link. But yeah, we can do that. Do repeat donators get multiple entries into the list? No, what I do is um I remove multiple copies before I transfer it over. Um, because otherwise you could just like spam three dollars, three dollars, three dollars, and I don't know, that feels weird. So everyone just gets one. Um, uh, let's see this link. It's going to be a long list for next week, that's for sure, after all those gift subs. Holy moly. Oh, first model ever painted. Right, let's have... um. Boom. This is from Tandy U. Tandy U's painted a little grot. It's pretty cool. So what kind of advice are you looking for? Like, this is great for a first model. You've, like, literally just keeping it in the lines is already putting you above, you know, half of the people who've painted their first model. Um, what advice would I give to improve? I mean, I'm not the world's best painter either. Take, like, realize that. This is, like, I'm like an okay painter. So this is not the best advice you're ever gonna get. But I really, I like that you've already got the shading working on the skin, that looks great. Um, and the washes are working. I think do something with the base. Get some sand on there or some textured paint or something like that. Just make it a bit more, um, and give the rim a second coat. Because I think it looks like you've used contrast paint there, so it's not quite even. So if you get like a non-contrast black, whip it around, give it a smooth finish. That will really help. Um, other than that, I think, yeah, like the silver again, like just get a bit of silver on the edges to like smooth it out a bit. Because contrast paint can go a bit inconsistent um other than that it's great man you've done doing real good the only other steps from here are to do some more progressive highlights like you could um you could mix a little bit of yellow in with your green and like do the edges of the knuckles and the nose and the tips of the ears just to give it that sort of even even like sharper highlight but you don't have to do any of that that's just ways to to like make it better looks great as is uh Thanks, really appreciate it. Yeah, no worries, man. Thank you for sharing your minis. Right, let's we should we carry on? We've got some quests. I need to like refresh myself on the quest before we get the clock running. Um, active quest is we needed to build fifteen hats to take to the Cadian outpost over here. The Cadians want want Soviet hats, and we have I think finished making them. Um, We've got 15 hats. Perfect. Okay, let's do this. Do, 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 do. Uh, we'll take the Scarecrow, the big muffalo who can carry all the hats for us. We'll take Crimson. Uh, nah. Should we? We'll take Alpha Cat. No, yeah, Alpha Cat's the, the stupido, isn't he? He might not get there in time. We will send these two. Oh god, the travel supplies glitch. Please, please no. Right, um... Hat, hat. No, nope, that's not a hat, that's gold. Hat, 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 hat. Hat. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Oh god, one of them's poor quality! 
I think they all have to be good or, or better, don't we? Um, oh, I thought I'd check that last week. Apparently I didn't. Yeah, they have to be normal or better. So, okay, so we've got one and a half days till it expires. And if the trip takes 0. 0.6 days. So we've got 0. 0.9 days to make one decent hat. Okay, like we can do this. We can do this. Uh, make a hat. Who's our best crafter? Um, is it Walrus? No, it's Kurushishi. Right, Kurushishi, wakey wakey. It's uh, 2 a.m. But you got hats to make, sir. Get on it. Come on, you can do it. Oh no, but they're only one-handed, aren't they? Oh no, that's that's someone else. This one's fine. Healthy old, old healthy Kurushishi. You can do this. A muffalo wool hat. Uh, how long's it taking you? It's eighty. Oh, okay, no, that's not too bad. It's gonna take about. About a minute and a half, two minutes. We can do this. We can have it made before lunchtime. Hmm. Perfect. Uh, well, while we wait for that, Kurushishi's going to sew that hat. I'm going to read your messages, guys. Um, oh, Kurushishi says, I literally work at 2 a.m. in a call center from home. Oh, my God. This is this is too real for you, then. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Sorry, Kurushishi. Didn't mean to, like, deliver the flashbacks. Uh, oh, someone sent me an AMA. Um, let me get get that up. Yeah, I'm super behind. If anyone sent me messages, we were... Um, I, was, I was doing the intro, and I just haven't read any of them yet. That's all right. I can do it. I can do it. Uh, let me just load up the screen. How can I, how can I filter? Sorry, we got a billion gift subs in at the start of the stream, which is amazing, but it's buried. Uh, any AMAs? Here we go. Mighty Apricot says, Ben Bot, how is life in the shroud? Have you abandoned the QA in your new forms? <laughs> oh man. So um, don't know if anyone here caught it, but yeah, I did a um. Oh, hang on, let's just check. It's good. Okay, now we can do the quest. Um. Last weekend, I did a Stellaris stream where we were playing robots who ended up escaping into the Shroud. Um, it was a really fun stream, actually. It was really good, streaming with Spiff and, and Bo and Remy and uh, Alex Rambler. And the Paradox guys put on a real good show. For anyone who hasn't caught it, you can you can check it out on, on YouTube or on on the, everyone's uh, Twitch channels. Um, I wasn't there for the end, though, so I don't really know what happened. I haven't watched Remy's stream yet. As far as I understand, we ended up just like leaving the galaxy and joining joining the warp monsters and going into their dimension. I'm not sure. Maybe spoiler alerts. Maybe don't spoil it in chat. Um Okay, that's the hats. What else are we gonna take? Um Have we got anything else we can we can sell? I guess we'll just bring all the garbage with us. We'll bring like these short bows. Um, and oh yeah, take kidney, kidney and lung. We might buy those. Uh, kind of want to keep everything else. All right, travel supplies. Um, two beds. Um, take like eight medicine and pemmican, like five hundred? Question mark. Never know how much food to send, and then I have to allow them to eat it because normally everyone has to eat paste, only paste. Um, there we go. Perfect. Rimmy posted a recap video today. Oh, perfect. I'll go to Rimmy's channel and check it out then. Thank you for the tip. That's good to know. Um, right, where is it? Crimson. There's, I think there's a rogue trader in orbit. There's an exotic good trader in orbit. Perfect. Let's talk to him. Uh, 
Uh, also, I did I did play a couple of days um, after the last stream to try and like tidy up the base and do some stuff. So there's a we did a little, you didn't miss anything interesting, but we did have a couple of days off camera where I was just like building little bits and needed building. Um, and I did finally build our first servo skull, but I haven't deployed it yet because I thought I'd save that for the stream. Um, right, I need components, so we're going to buy components from the rogue trader in orbit. Um, we're going to... Um, we're going to get rid of the kidney and the lung. We're going to... Oh, we've got a pain stopper, nice. We're going to get rid of the venom fangs. And have you not got any bionic arms? That is annoying. I was hoping you would. Um, has he got anything worth buying? Has he got beer? Our guys don't deserve beer. We've been cowards. Um, I think I think that's all. They've, oh, they got joints. We can make our own joints. We don't need to buy them. God, advanced components are expensive, huh? Jeez. I think that'll do then. Architect eye. Well, no one's got a damaged eye. Do you think we should just buy it speculatively in case someone loses an eye later? I guess it's better than a real eye, right? Um, what does that actually do? Doesn't, doesn't really say what it does. Check print for specialized limbs. Is that are they good? The specialized limbs? Aren't they just like dig claw and punch arm? Is that important? Um, well, it's only a thousand. Sure. If you say it's good. Crafter needs bionic hand. He does need a bionic hand, but they don't have any, right? Specialized limbs are not are not the same as bionics. They're like drill arm. Um and like ho ho hand. No, there wasn't any other bionics, was there? Well, it's right. We're researching it. We'll get there. All right, but now, first of all, we've got um. Oh no! Did we leave one of the hats behind? <gasps> oh, they just haven't loaded it yet. Okay. Oh God! Oh, I'm stuck there. Don't want to fail this quest. Um. What are you doing? Oh, you're making EMP grenades. Cool. Because we've actually got um, we've got a mechanoid base here. In the next three and a half days, it's going to block out the sun. So we're going to have to deal with this. I'm making an extra pair of um, EMP grenades so we can go over and stun all those turrets. Um, okay, there we go. Right, well, we should install the... Um, Oh, another exotic goods trader. Hello. Oh, look. Anklick on the blacks here. Pistol. Rep, rep. Uh, Pepper Jack. Uh, Simply Dave. Infidel Tech. It's all you guys. Chat's come to pay a visit. Hello. Let's go send Crimson to go chat to Simply Dave. Ah, we finished prosthetics, right? So then after prosthetics, we want bionic replacements. It's like the next step up. Right, what do these guys have for us? Um, more components. We will take them. Uh, Plasteel, don't really need that. Animal pulse, I don't need that. Ooh, skill trainer melee, skill trainer mining. Um... Yeah, quite, I might buy those, actually. Skill train is always good. Um, you need a monkey. 
Well, I guess we do need a monkey. You're right. Oh, how silly of me. <laughs> what was I thinking? I didn't even see the little monkey boy. I didn't even know monkeys were in RimWorld. Jeez, this game is always surprising me. Um... Sadly, no arms. That's alright. It's still a good haul. And in fact, to be honest, we're running out of cash. I need to sell them something. Um, but all the stuff we've got, I kind of want to keep. There's nothing I want to sell. Got Naren Lord to squig. Because for 186 bucks, it's pretty good. We could sell some Plasteel, but... You need it in the end game. Um, that'll do for now. We'll get crafting. Um, monkey! Right, Monkey needs a name. Let me get the... Um, I've got to name it after one of you big generous um, gift suppers, right? Dark Kip. It's you, sir. Unless you don't want to be a monkey. I didn't even consider that. Surely you do. Be madness. Who wouldn't want to be monkey? Give the monkey diet bionics. <laughs> there we go. Um, he's a Jakiro, of course. Actual 40k monkeys. We also have a cow and a bull. You're right, we do actually have more animals than we used to. Um, these guys need names too. Okay, <laughs> uh, caravan's gone. Going, going, going. Let's um, let's spin the wheel then. Get the list of of donos up. Um, we shall spin the wheel for for cow cow name. The wheel of cow names. Goes there. Then uh, random number generator. Uh, do Thirteen. It's oh, it's Koroshenko. Well, thank you for donating Koroshenko, but you're already in the game. Oh no, you're not. No, you're not. Um, cool. Koroshenko, you are a cow. Give me your delicious milk. Uh, Koreshenko, welcome. And then the bull makes a very different kind of milk. You shall be da -da -da -da. Dagal. Dagal the bull boy. Is it two Gs or one? Two. Perfect. Hopefully this is enough food for them. Um, and they're all... Perfect. Right, let's train this squig up. Perfect. Alright, so I've just tidied the base up a bit. We've just installed some lamps so it's a bit lighter outside. We've got a little, little pathway. This, this is what I did while we were off screen. Nice little path to walk around. Um, we tidied up this room a bit. We made a secondary storage bay so that they're not walking all the way over here to get the components and then walking all the way back. Um, so this one's just for, like, components. And this one's for junk. Right, then, who's going to get the skill trainers? Because we've got three skill trainers now, I believe. Um, if you could, someone could actually bring them in. Because they're just going get, to get wrecked lying outside. Koroshenko says that he's lazy. You do have a character? Where? Is he? Oh, he's Izzy. Oh, of course. I'm dumb. Thank you, chat. 
easy. I forgot that was you, Koroshenko. Got confused. Um, right, well, let's spin the wheel again. Do -do -do -do. 16. That's Sergeant Oddball. Um, perfect. There we go. Thank you. Quest. Did we get there? Hooray! We did the trade! Quest complete. What did we get? We got seven advanced components, which are they're like 300 bucks each. So that's massive. Plus 500 bucks. Oof, that's close. Hey, that almost timed out. <laughs> we had like until the end of the day to do it. Oof. Thank you, chat. I got I got distracted naming stuff. Oh, I'm really glad we did that. That was, um, would have been a lot of hats that we couldn't have used. Advanced components are needed for bionics. I think they are, actually. Yeah, that's, that's perfect. We've got some two new quests to do as well. Um, they want us to lend four colonists. Oh, for a bionic arm! Okay, 14 days is a long time. Can we survive without four of our guys for, for 14 days? I don't know. And the other quest is two groups of tribes are harassing. Send them a challenge and deal with them yourself. The first group will be 11, 11 tribals and then another group of 11 a few after. And we're in two days. Um, hmm. Well, I think we can probably handle the tribals. 14 days is probably too long. They, we will get attacked by like an orc or something in that time and Having half our guys away, we'll probably lose. We won't be able to accept a quest like that until we've got better automated turrets, I think. Um, but we can do this one. We could probably handle the tribals. I think we'll have to do it for honor, because Meat, Meat Rocket was our royalty, and he died. So we're kind of starting again with the royalty quest. Um... And while we're here, let's trade. Oh, I forgot to bring, send them any money. They can't really do a trade. Oh, we got the 500 bucks they paid us, though. Okay, so we do have a little bit of money we can play with. Um, God, we've been doing a lot of trading today, haven't we? A bionic eye? Don't really need it. Got, got loads of brains. Uh, give them those bows. Um, they've got some crap clothes, probably because I sold them to them. A crew skin corset. <laughs> oh my. Very sexy. Uh, give them the crap hat too. Why not? Um, wow, 40,000 bucks. 17,000 for an iron halo. Oof. Traitor guard armor? Hmm. Um, I don't think they've really got anything we want, to be honest. I could just buy some steel from them. Always need more steel. Um, since our miners are brain damaged. Like 500? That's too much to carry. 200? We can carry 200. Um, perfect. Okay, we'll take 200 steel. Alright, bring it home. Right, we need to install this um, servo skull. Um, where should we put it? I guess we'll put it in the kitchen, right? Because then it'll be close to... What kind of work can it do? Uh, it can do hauling and cleaning. So mainly we're going to want it to clean the kitchen and the med, med bay. And the hauling will help with the bringing the crops in. So I think this is kitchen bot. Um, install kitchen bot in the morning. Quest expires in seven hours. 
of course. What? What do you mean? That one. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not going to do this one. I can't. I can't do it. Um. Thank you, Jay Wood, for cheering 100 bits. Durpledores donated five dollars and says petition for the Emperor to bestow the Omnistar's blessing upon the monkey, aka give it tons of Robo parts. Do, can I even do that? Do animals have the option? Where is he? Dark Kip. At the moment, he's sleeping in the doghouse. Um. No, I don't think you can give him Bionix. It's probably a mod. We could put a mod on for next week. I'll, I'll try and I'll try and fix that for next week. Take me into battle. Oh, thank you, Dparsex, just donated and says, um, "Glad you're doing well in the UK. Have you been visiting the pub yet? Have fun and stay safe." Also, here's a link to my newly painted intercessors from my custom chapter, The Artifactors. Relic Hunters Extraordinaire. Oh, but there isn't actually a link, Dparsec. The link got lost in the warp. Um, but yeah, um, things are, I guess, slowly turning back to normal. Um, I went to the pub on Tuesday for a drink. Nothing too crazy. It's just a pint. And it was fun and weird. Very weird being back. But got to start somewhere, right? I, what I'm really looking forward to is actually just being able to go to someone's house or have someone at my house and play a board game or a war game in real life. Like, that is something that I've not been able to do for so long. And I used to just go to, like, conventions and tournaments and stuff all the time. It was, like, my main thing to do Take away from work and, um, and family and stuff. And I've not been able to do it for, for a year now. I can't wait. I can't wait for that. That's more important than the pub for me. God, someone. Ah, Servo Cell. Servo Skull. We, right, we can name him. Um, we are going to name him Zubal Dude. Welcome, Zubal Dude. You are clean and food bot. Activate. Uh, where do I name him? Robots. Here. Servo Skull 1. Oh, it's doing that thing again. Was it, was it insert? You made it do that? Nope. Why can't I name you? Did we find out the fix for this? Um, Click and drag. Aha! Thank you. What a weird glitch. Um, Zubal dude. Is that how I spell it? Doesn't look right. Um, yeah, it is. Okay. Thank you, Zubal Dude. I will read your message in a sec. You are now a clean bot. The old the old kitchen bot. Made out of one of our dead colonist brains. Beep boop, beep boop. Look at him go. Beep boop. Where's he going? Oh, he's gone to get the uh get the carcasses out of the kill box. Fair enough. Got to, got to clean out. Oh, now he's gone to... Uh, can you get the components? They're deteriorating. Dude. I can't, simple dude. No. I can't. I can't directly control him. He's a mind of his own. He does what he will. None can stop him. Alright. We're going to have to get ready for the... Um, the... What's it called? The tribal attacks coming soon, right? Should we... Spike traps. Which wood have we got? I think we've got enough for one more. Okay. Uh, okay, right, well, I'll get the job done, hopefully, pretty soon. Where's Izzy? Right, Izzy, stop gardening. Build these spike traps, please. Um, do we have much steel? Wooden traps don't do much. Oh, I didn't realise... Um, 
I didn't realize the material determined the damage. Take me into battle. Oops. Oh well. When these when these go, we'll replace them with something better. We are a bit short on steel. We've only well, we've got five hundred, but we're gonna burn through five hundred steel really fast. Um, but that's good to know. Thanks for the tip. Maybe we've got a bit more steel. Is this steel? Oh my god, it is. I've actually got some in the base. Perfect. Um, wow, 40 versus 100 damage. Holy moly. Right, where were we? Um, Ram Dumb Bot has uh, donated 200 bits. Thank you, dude. And says, I just rewatched the Terror from the Deep series. That show was recommended to me on YouTube, and it's what brought me into the Yogscast and Twitch in general. Thank you, much love. Oh my god, random bot. Thank you very much. I really Thank enjoyed you, playing Terror from the Deep. That was like one of the first streams I ever did. Before we got into any kind of mods or anything. That's an old one, but it was a lot of fun. Glad you enjoyed it, and it was enough to like get you in the door. It's very cool. Oh, Sunburnt sunburn Orc gave out another gift sub. Thank you very much. Uh, ah, caravan's home. Perfect. I was getting worried the attack was going to come before the caravan arrived. Uh, we got a new quest. They want us to build a giant stone monument that's going to use up... Oh my god, like 1,300 blocks. Um, complete within 29 days. After completion, you must protect it for 70 days. If any piece of it is destroyed, the Knights in Fortland system will activate... And a new site will appear nearby where there's a climate adjuster machine shifting regional temperatures by 10 degrees with four turrets and one tyranid to defend the site. This threat will remain until you destroy it. <sighs> 70 days, that's a long time. And this many blocks means it's going to be massive. I'm going to have to, like, extend the, the base perimeter to fit it in. Um, but what's the reward? Three resurrection serums. <gasps> oh my god. I've never had one resurrector serum. Um. So what does that actually do? It brings the dead back to life. Unfortunately, the resurrection sometimes come back with brain damage, blindness, or psychosis. Outcomes are better when they are delivered to a fresh body. If the body is preserved, it can be regenerated long after death. <gasps> Oh no, but we butchered we all of our dead guys. We had them preserved, and then we cut them up for organs. Because we needed brains to make servo droids. So we can't bring back any of the old deadies with it. Um, Build the monument into the mountain. That's true, we could. We could dig out. Dig out this whole part of the mountain and build an like, underground monument. That'd be pretty good. When does it expire? How long have we got? Three days? Oh, my God. Uh, bugs. Oh, God, yeah. Bugs could spawn inside the monument. And just fighting the bugs will definitely destroy a part of it. That's a good point. That won't work. Um, tricky. Also, enemies will not just attack a monument. Take me into oh. battle. Um, I think I could build it like here, and just build out more perimeter walls with turrets. It can be done. I can't say no to three resurrection serums, can I? That's insane. Um, and we've got thirty days to build it after we accept. I think we're going to go for it. Mr. Dono with a link. Yeah, there, there's a lot of donos. I haven't gone through them all yet. I'm really sorry if I haven't read your message yet. Um, I didn't want this to be an hour of reading messages before we started playing the game. So um, I will. I will do it in a sec. Um, oh, solid gold meteorite. Um, wow. Okay, that's awesome. I'm trying to remember that's there. Um... We do already have enough parts. 
Are there custom weapon sounds for the 40k weapons? Yeah, yeah, there are. The bolt guns sound really meaty. Where's the robot gone? He should be bringing the crops in. Oh, there he is. Okay. Why is it crimson? He's too busy smoking joints. He should be researching. That's like your number one priority, Crimson. Don't milk. No, okay, Ollie Yeet is, is researching instead, apparently. Fine. You can reorder the colonist bar by right-clicking and dragging. Oh, that's good to know. Ah, look at that. Okay, so I can have the cowards at one end and the fight men at the other. Uh, shoot, 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 shoot. Melee. Okay, yeah, no, that's good to know. Thank you. I did not know that. Um. All right, what am I doing? All right, we're going to clear out some space for that mega monument. Um. Well, I think I'll wait till after the um, after the tribal attack. Is that tribal attack coming? I feel like I can't really start anything until this happens. Um, two days. 1.7 days ago. Okay, they'll be here any minute. Okay, we'll deal with that first. Um, you probably don't need to bother cleaning this, dude. I don't really need a pristine kill box. Uh, what do I need for a T2, T to a Mark Two servo skull box? Four ceramite, five imperial components, five nano components, two power cores. Holy shit, that's a lot of stuff. What about a T1? Um. Two ceramite, four components, one power core. Power core needs. Okay, let's let's get a power core going. We've got enough refined bits. I think we do. Take me uh, we can get a second servo skull. I think. Uh, also, add the blue background to your colonist bar. Is their mood? You can see how quickly and unhappy they're in the background. Yeah, no, I know that one. It's, it's why the, the big colonists are annoying, because when they're really fat, you can't see where the bar is. But the skinny ones, it's easy to tell how a skinny boy feels. There's a mod for color-coded. Ah, that would be handy. I should put that mod on. Ah, here they come. Um, approaching from multiple directions, they're going to use sappers. Shit. Really hoping it wouldn't be sappers. Okay, how many have we got? Um, we've got five down there. Um, we've got three down there. We've got three up there. How do the tribals use sappers? I think it just means they dig through walls. You know, they, they've just got picks, pickaxes. Okay, that's a massive problem. It's going to be way harder. Um, hmm. We need a. We need like security stations set up all around the base. Are any of them going to come into the kill box? Or are they all going to dig? Uh, yeah, it looks like they were just going to dig. Fuckers. Um, Alright. Everyone, wakey wakey! Um, not exactly where are they coming in. Okay, they're going to come in there. It's going to take them a while to dig through two walls. These guys... Oh. Oh. Okay. Right. 
this is it. So we've got one here, one here, and one here. Um, what are the weapons like? Spears and knives. Spears. Um, you really need unpowered turrets in the corridor. Yeah, I do. I couldn't afford them originally, and now I've got a bit of cash. I should have done it before they arrived. I'll do it after this. I've got three there. Okay. Um, I think I'm going to have to wait out here. We could make a little barricade. Although they're all melee, they're just going to come straight at me. The barricade's pointless. Um... Right, the two medics can get out of the line of fire. Um, we'll have the two melees up front. And then the shoot guys. Like this. Okay, this is the plan. We'll just let them breach in. May as well open that door, save them breaking it, right? There we go. Come and get it, boys. Boom! Nerds. Nice. Okay. Um... Take me into battle. Am I going to break through there? That's not so bad. Oh, they are coming into the kill box now. Okay. Um. Let's send. Give me two. To the kill box. Oh, one pack's fleeing. Perfect. Uh, one of them got his leg stuck in the trap. It's bleeding out. Perfect. Um, who got on that heavy bolter gun? Cool Jedi, get on the other heavy bolter. Nice. Oh, it's working! Come on. Yeah! Okay, that, that pack's broken. Um, oh, you assholes. So petty. Oh, I'm just going to sma smash your, bre your bed. <laughs> I'm scared of actually fighting you. You dicks. Wait, is it worth dying? Is it worth dying to break my bed? Jeez. Okay, we've got another raid. Oh my god, the other raid came so fast. Raid number two. We've got three down here. And we got eight over here. We've got some bows and arrows mixed in there. Um, we've got two more over here. Okay. Okay. Um, are any of these worth capturing? That's the next question. Oh, you're an amazing fighter. You're tough, bloodlust, uh, passion for fighting. You, skunk. You, you can join. Um, we've got a crafter. Okay, you're worth capturing too, actually. Um, let's get the medics. Capture these two. Um, are these guys all dead? I think so. Okay, well now we've got entry points. I guess they're just going to come in this way. So we'll... Um Faith is our shield. We'll deploy either side of this. You two can come back. Uh, we'll leave you guys on heavy bolters for now. See if any come in that way. Um, a bit worried about the group of eight. Um, I 
don't know if these guys count as... Yeah, they are all just coming here. They might not be sappers, I'm not sure. I wonder if closing this door will like change their change their direction. Why, why aren't you closing the door? There we go. Is that gonna change them? Or are they still just gonna hit the door? No, they're still coming. I think. Yeah, they're coming. Okay. Open the door. No, Naren Lord, the squigs got in there. Uh, right, you guys get off the guns. Come over here. Got that bolt pistol. Seems to be doing work. Oh, they're fleeing. They're afraid. Some of them are afraid. Not all of them are afraid. Oh, Alpha Cat, stop it! Oh, we've still got one jerk who's determined to break everything before he leaves. Go get him, guys. Um, ah, that guy's down. Perfect. Um, that can't be the nearest. Guys, don't... Both go through the fucking barbed wire to get the medic. Um, get the medicine. Like. There you go. Go to the. Right. Is this guy worth saving? Dead in four hours. Can craft. I'll try. Try and save him. Um, one has a scarred brain. Oh, did I miss that? Um, which one? How can you tell? Oh, this one. Oh. Yeah, they're... Oh, and a wooden foot. Jeez. Um, yeah, okay, don't, don't, don't save that one. Um, how do I do it? What do I uh, execute? Uh, cannot. Why isn't this working? Not a sign to warning. God's sake. Uh, Incapable of violence. Arg. Okay, what about Cool Jedi? Can you do it? Right. Cool Jedi can kill. God, this is get this game gets fiddly sometimes. Right. Right. Oh, I was gonna do the fire first. Don't don't do the fire first. There we go. We got it. We got it. Okay, right. Now you capture the other guy. You heal this guy. Okay, it's working. Right. You guys put this fire out. <laughs> oh, nice work. Right, Raven. Got chopped by cool Jedi. Perfect. Don't eat on the floor. There's a table right there, you dickhead. Okay, we're gonna save Skunk. Um Maybe. Maybe we're gonna save him. 
This guy's only got four hours left to live. Can we just... Come on. Okay, this one's in no immediate danger. Right, switch. Triage time. Got to go get more medicine. Um, there we go. There we go. Okay, do it, do it, do it. Uh, is the squig okay? Good point, actually. Where's the squig? An Aaron Lord? Uh, oh, no! It jaw got shattered and its tail got cut off. Oh, my God. An Aaron Lord. Um, how did that happen? Uh, doesn't really say. Oh! Yeah, one of the one of the, just got skewered by a spear. Um, yeah, that's like ninety percent of the squig. You're right. The jaws are pretty pretty critical part. Okay, well, don't worry. None of our guys got too badly hurt, so they should be treated very quickly. Um, we got plenty of medics on the case. Fix all these holes. Man, that actually wasn't too bad. Um, I think we got off pretty lightly there. There was a lot of them. And they didn't really go into the kill box. So th that could have been an absolute disaster. But we only really lost a few beds. Um, and a squig tail, which is sad. But not the end of the world. What are these guys doing? How's Crimson? Uh, still bleeding. Still bleeding. Um, let's get the medics working overtime here. Ah, oh, there we go. Cool Jedi's dealing with it. Ooh. <laughs> How did you get a sub to this channel? Um, someone. A lot of people gave out a lot of gift subs earlier. So, um, enjoy. It's, it's probably one of the worst value subs you'll ever find. I only really stream for about five or six hours a week. Uh, but enjoy it while it lasts. Uh, do my mods allow for prosthetic tails? I need to put the animal mod on, and then I guess we'll find out. The animal bionics mod. We shall see. Um... Oh my god, that was intense. Right, okay, we'll get rid of these um, wooden traps now. We can replace them with better ones later. Um, got the little robot, Zubal Dude, carrying corpses around. Very good. We can start... Oh man, this is like... Like uber, uber organs. Just organs! Mail order. We've got 15 corpses to cut up. Oh, so good. It's bad, isn't it, that we, we're we basically... We, we only use the herbal medicine on the people. If someone's bleeding to death, we'll herbal medicine them. If someone's already dead, we'll use the good stuff. That's what the real medicine's for. Getting those sweet, sweet organs. The robot will cremate them too. No, they won't. I've set the cremator to not uh, cremate fresh bodies. It only cremates... Um, um, what's it called? Uh, like, rotten ones. Because I want all the fresh ones to be saved for, um, for organs. We should probably make a separate room for it. I mean, I know there's a telly to distract you, but this is not relaxing, is it? How's Naren Lord? Oh, he's poor little tailless squig. Poor baby. Ooh, ah, brilliant. Crimson can have his ceremony. Fantastic. There they are. Tiberius has arrived to bestow the... Oh my god, it's like the Inquisition have turned up. Jeez. Do not mess with these guys. 
Right, Crimson, your weird mates have turned up. Imperial med kits are as good as Glitter World medicine. And you can make the Imperial ones. Oh, okay, I don't think I can make the Imperial ones yet, but that's good to know. Um, I haven't done a lot of medicine research yet. Still trying to get those bionic arms. Right then. Tiberius, the ominous Emperor Man, is bestowing psychic powers onto Crimson. Ta da! He's a yeoman. Brilliant. See you later, creepies. Okay, um, have we got any spare beds? We'll have to make new ones. Yeah, these are all bed rolls. Okay, we don't have enough wood to replace all of this stuff. Uh, we're going to have to cut, chop, chop that wood. Imperial med kits take a lot. Five refined karma, five cloth, one herbal medicine. Okay. Do subs get put on the wheel? They do get put on the wheel, Coldrick. Do indeed. Yay, bionic arms. Okay. Um cool. Right, let's start getting some armor, I think. So we needed two bionic arms. Um uh, okay. what do they take? Four advanced components each. Ah, they're so expensive. Um Oh well, we need them. Our boys need arms. They are literally two. Two of our guys have one arm each. Oh god, infection. Skunk. He's a dirty skunk and he's infected. How bad is it? It's in his torso. It's not a good spot for it. Um. Take me let's, um, let's put him in a real bed. Actually, can you clean the whole room? Because, gross. Blood everywhere. That can't help with the infection. Um, no, we've got no more traders yet. It's alright, we'll get some more components. It's just, they don't turn up very often and they're pretty expensive. So it feels, feels bad, man. Um, right, who are, we, we lost most of our builders, didn't we? It's literally just Izzy who can do it. Is that right? Um, we've got a couple of threes. I guess threes can put up walls. Uh, yeah. He's got a psychic addiction. Is it worth the hassle? Is he? Only 33%. We don't have any psych. So, you know, it'll, it'll wear off, right? He'll go cook turkey and eventually he'll be fine. Because look, I mean, I just think he's going to become a badass. He's got like a burning passion to just kick ass. And for crafting. These are like things we need. And mining. Bloodlust and tough. This guy's going to be like the savage recruit. You know, it's like Space Marines recruiting from Death Worlds to find guys like him. And if not, you know, organs. Right, Izzy, I'm going to have to p just concentrate on building for you now. Um, cuz you're the only the only builder. Other people are going to have to bring in the harvest. Um, again, we haven't really got many people who can. Uh Kurushishi and Olit. Do. Oh my god, look at all these organs! It's perfect. And then what's left? All the organless body parts, the dogs can eat. It's the circle of life. Um. Oh, Ipodax. 
What up, dude? Why are you here? On, all on your own. It's weird. Right, we really need to start replacing these damaged walls, guys. Come on. Get on it. Right, while we wait for them, let's, um... Let's read some of your lovely messages. Tea with biscuits donated. Thank you. And they say, Vodgobo here. Got two hours I can watch before my D&D &D game starts. Watching your non-combatants get shot by arrows <laughs> two weeks ago pained me. So I made this cover infographic. Hope it's not unwanted backseat gaming. Ah, thank you very much. Let's have a look at it. If it's something I didn't know existed in the game, then I will welcome it. Um, uh, boom. Only cover your next two works. Pawns can peek around walls for good cover when you don't have the Imperial fortifications. Oh. So like this guy, not in cover. This guy is in cover. This guy is in cover. Uh... This guy, also in cover. This guy in cover. Okay, good to know. Makes sense. Something's happening. What's going on? Alpha Cat. What happened to you, Alpha Cat? Um. While well, and Alpha Cat talked about friendly blacksmiths, then he fell over. Why? Um, rescue Alpha Cat, please. Oh yeah, I need everyone back on the paste as well. Paste, paste. And the prisoners also need to be on the paste diet. Um, where is it? Is it health? Paste. Paste is love. Recruit. And recruit. Perfect. Oh my god! <laughs> That's too many organs, to be honest. Too many organs. Um, Jeez. Ten kidneys. Four livers. Twelve lungs. Seven brains. <laughs> Um, jeez. <laughs> okay, take a break. You can take a break now, please, Izzy. Um, suspend the organs. We've got enough, I think. Oh, Epodax is leaving. Where did he go? Um, oh, we're never going to catch him. We might catch him. Because we can run out the side door. I wanted to see if he wanted to trade. You got any shinies? Um, he's got three Lucifarium, one Medicine, five meals, and that's it. He went for a walk. And a wool hat. Okay, and none of that's really very useful. Um, sure, I'll just grab your Medicine and your food. Uh, take me it. into battle. I'll, just get, I'll take your one Medicine. Sure. Fill the men with organs. <laughs> Check the crafting room. A table was broken in there. What's that? Oh, shit. Someone busted the machine table? Why? Jeez. That sucks. Um... Quest available. Epic emus. 57 man-hunting emus. <sighs> That's a lot of birds. Um, 10 cataphracts will be placed under your control. You will have to feed and house them. And they may die in battle without consequences. Um, 
I mean, that's an insane amount of birds, but 10 cataphracts are probably pretty strong, right? This is like the Great Australian Emu War. Is, is history going to repeat itself? Um... Oh, I don't know. I, I mean, 57 of anything is really dangerous. I can't, I honestly can't tell if this is insanity or not. Um. I, I don't know. I don't know if that's easy or either incredibly easy or totally impossible. I can't, I can't tell. Um. If it was, if I didn't get the 10 cataphracts, I'd say no way. Um. We need to be able to kill them all in melee because there's no way 57 aren't getting into melee. Yeah, they will get into melee, but we've got these, like, emergency bunkers, right? We can just sit in here. They'll, I mean, they'll probably bash down the doors, right? Um... And while they're, while they're pecking away at these doors, we'll be, like, gunning them down. Um... Yeah, we could just stand here in the doorway. I think we, we I think we can do it, but we've got to um, fill in all the walls holes first. Kurashishi's having a tantrum. Oh, Kurashishi, please. Uh, right, where's Izzy? Okay, Izzy's working on the wall. Oh, you, you built, you built the, the on the wrong side, Izzy. <laughs> Digging the dumb way round. Um, I wonder if we turn this on. This is active now, anyway. The sun's being blocked, so we need to take this out sooner rather than later, anyway. Um, what if we turn this on, trigger this, and then hope that the emus like come near it? Um, they won't know, will they? They're manhunters. They'll ignore this. Probably. Um. Kralak the Defector. Who the fuck are you? Um. Oh, we could have a cataphract activate it. <gasps> Kamikaze cataphract. Interesting. The mechs will attack the manhunters. Okay, so if we leave one guy, at, like, here... The emus will come for him, and then they'll come into the range of the turrets. And the turrets will absolutely wreck them. Um... I want to see that fight. I want to see 57 emus charge a mech turret. Um, okay. We'll get the walls fixed first, and then we're going to go for it. Well, I'll probably have to save, because it could be absolute insanity. Um, right, build that wall first. Then that wall. Then that wall. Then... Then wait. Sheep join. How many sheep? Aw. Three sheep. Okay. Uh, cool Jedi sad. What's sad about you, sir? Still sad about Meat Rocket dying. I'm sad about Meat Rocket dying too. Don't worry. You're in the dark and you're out without a table. I mean, that's on you, sir. Um, I think you're going to be fine. Does that meet Rocket's grave? No, it's Thunder Twonk. Okay. Uh, right, where's the builder? 
Don't really have time for chilling, is he? We got patch holes to patch. Um, can you actually build the wall I told you to build? How about that? Why can't they? Oh, because I've put the bricks down already. Uh, okay, so if I cancel that. And go there. God, the micromanagement is real, isn't it? Um, okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Shit, whoops. We locked a cougar in the walls. Masterwork. That's a masterwork wooden bed. Wow, well, lucky lucky whoever gets to sleep in that. Um Okay, it's it's are we secure now? Is that all the holes patched? I think so. Right, have we got to also... This, the building the monument expires in seven hours. Um, I'm going to accept that. And the emus... They'll attack 18 hours after accepting. Why did we lock an old woman in a wall? Oh, a cougar. Right, I get it. Whoops. Uh, right, we're going to save. And we're going we're gonna to try and um, do the Manhunters. Where is the monument marker? There it is. How big is this thing? Hooey! It's a big boy! have to really expand the perimeter so this is a problem for later we can build this monument after we've dealt with the um everything else um could be the bed could be an artwork uh it doesn't say it is but that'd be fun uh right crimson is not quite healed up yet either um he probably needs another night how long have we got before we got to accept it? 23 hours. Okay, we can do it in the morning. Um, God, I'm, I'm really nervous about this. Really nervous. Um, so what are we going to do? We're going we're gonna to walk a cataphract out here. Try and get him killed. Draw their fire. Get the emus to attack the robots. Then everyone else is going to hang back here. And we're going to have some cataphracts, like, in the in the choke point. Everyone else in the bunkers should be fine. How many emus? 57. Um, it's a lot. Can we remake Meat Rocket out of all the extra organs we have? <laughs> I wish. Um, Alpha Cat dropped, dropped their weapon, did they? Did they pick? Yeah, they dropped their las las gun. Uh, did they get their las gun back when they like randomly collapsed? Um, is that bionic arm coming? It's nearly done. Do you want to activate the crash ship too? No, I don't. I think that will be madness. Um, we could, I suppose. Take me into battle. Okay, fully healed. What is it? It's two now. Two in the morning. So if I 
start it now, they'll attack in 18 hours, which will be 8 o'clock tonight. I think that's probably good. Faith is our shield. Um, oh, thank you for the bits, Fraser. Um, catching up on the VODs. Thanks for all the streams. Thank you. You're welcome. And thank you, um, and Angelo, for using your Twitch Prime. I appreciate that as well. One Molotov could work. Um, this is going to get ugly. It really is. Um, let's do it. What's the reward? Melee trainer, hyperweave. Persona Zeus Hammer? Or the Goodwill. I mean, that Zeus Hammer sounds amazing. Five grand value. It's like an AI Giga Hammer. Um, could try placing a sleeping spot next to the mechs and see if that wakes them up. I don't think that would wake them up. There's no like proximity scanner or anything. Um, I think just attacking them would be the trick. Okay, let's take the hammer. Take me into battle. Where are the cataphracts? Oh, wow, look at them. Oh, they're not all wearing cataphract armor. God, there's a lot of them. It's like a bloody clown car. But look at them, they're repairing everything. Faith is our shield. Look at them, look at them go. This guy's, this guy's doing an art. These guys are fixing everything. Oh, yeah, they've just come to sort my life out for me. Wow. I wish this would happen in real life. Like a makeover crew just drop in and solve all my problems and fix all my little odd jobs that I have yet to do. Oh. They're coming to show me how it's really done. <laughs> Putting me to shame. Okay, so. Um, what have we got? Um, and in return, we're going to have them killed by emus. <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> okay, this guy came in without armor. Um, and he's got a plasma sword. Faith is our um, oh my god, Faust! Holy moly, Faust giving out 20 gift subs! <whistles> thank you, Faust. That's incredibly generous. Make sure to say thank you if you uh, if you picked up a gift sheep. sub from Faust. That's incredible. Thank you very much. Um, should we name all these guys? I think we should. We'll care more about them when they die. Faith is our this shield. first one is Faust. Thank you. Um, uh, let me go Faith get back a bit shield. more. Uh, we've got this next one is Darinath. Thank you. And then is our start shield. spinning the wheel. Chat wants you to see, see you get the Optimus Prime toy. I think I could do it now. We've had so many gift subs. We probably can get it. Hopefully we can get it in stock. Um, Faith is our shield. Right, let's spin the wheel again. Um, where's, where's the wheel? There it is. Uh, Faith is our shield. This one is Scout Master Chris. Welcome. This one Faith is, our is shield. Sleepy Idiot. Welcome. And this one is Faith is our shield. H. H. L. Mad Larkin. Welcome aboard. This one is. Um, Faith is our shield. Chuckna. Welcome. Thank you. This one is. Suro. Zero the Death is here. Is our shield. He's got a pretty badass guy. What, what weapon have they got? A Vanaheim shotgun. It's not quite the Nemesis Halberd you wanted, Zero, but it's pretty cool. 
Um, this guy. Tea with biscuits. Thank you. And this one is... Joe Jagger. Thank you. There you go. Right. They're all good in combat. Joe Jagger's got a minigun. T with biscuits has got a heavy bolter. Very cool. Suro's got a shotgun. Um, Chuck Nah has a knife. <laughs> like, not quite the same kind of... Oh, and a, and a bio-coded charge lance. Okay, that makes more sense. Um, Mad Larkin has got a heavy bolter. Um, Sleepy Idiot's got a charge rifle. Scoutmaster's got a minigun and a knife. Um, Darren F's got a minigun. Um, oh, Fosmo, you need a name too. Adamantium Gladius for you. Faith is our shield. Um, but also, GRBH. Thank you. Um, and Faust has Faith got Plasma shield. Sword. Okay, that's everyone in. Um, oh my god, Faust! Faust giving the, all the cheers, cheering all the bits. Jeez, how many is that? It's 1,380 bits, which is like $140. Holy shit, Faust. What are you doing? That's crazy. They say, oh, and for the badge, and for the bits god, for the hat trick. Oh my god, Faust. Thank you very much. That is that is crazy generous. It's coming at me from all angles. I can't I cannot avoid. God. Thank you so much, dude. That's that's crazy. I love it. Um Warmaster says, Have I read your dono? I have not yet, actually. I've I'm I'm pretty behind. I've got a lot of messages to read. Um Oh, Anti Brian used up forty thousand channel points and says the return of chief scribe Arthonius the third let this be his origin story hopefully I have now spent 146,000 channel points oh, fucking hell. um we can name something after you anti Brian but um do you want one of these guys these guys are all gonna die um or even if they don't die they're gonna leave they're not permanent members would you want me to save save that for like when I convert one of these two prisoners? One of these guys is going to join. You can have one of these if you want. Uh, the sheep do need names. That's true. <laughs> um. Take me into battle. We'll see how it goes. I've done I've done the naming for now. Um, well, they're not even sheep. They're rams. What's the point of a ram? Can I still cut their fur? Can I shave them? Um. Take me into battle. JC Rav stream. He got a crazy amount of subs and donuts and had a 30 minute breakdown. <laughs> oh my god, no, I did not see Rav's stream. Wow, good for Rav's. Holy moly. Is, just F Is it be generous to, to Yogg's day today? I can get on board with that. It says that there is a stat for wall growth. Oh yeah, 65.5% wall growth. Okay. Um, well, we can name these people. Uh, a ram is a male sheep. Yeah, I know. I just, I just didn't know. Um, I was thinking like rams are not as good as sheep because you can milk a sheep. But you can't milk a ram. Well, you can milk a ram. You just can't make a nice cheese out of it. Um, this one is Gustavus the second. Very fancy sheep. Um, this one is. Wolf Lord Lewis, welcome aboard. And this one is uh, spin the wheel again. And this one is 
D parsec. Okay. So I'll have to fit you in in a minute. Um, channel points. Where was that? It was Antibrine, Chief Scribe Artonius. We'll, we'll do that with the next person I can name. I didn't want to do 40,000 channel points for a RAM. That felt bad. Um, so we'll we'll stick it on one of these prisoners as soon as they they uh, they turn. Um, Faust says honestly, Ben, Tom, and Ravs are my top three yogs, and I try to donate whenever I can and have the extra cash. Oh, top tier people. Oh, thank you, Faust. I hope you can afford it. Um, I, f I feel bad taking such large sums of money from from people unless it's just literally spare cash. Like, you know, pay your bills. <laughs> like, but thank you, thank you very much. Um. But he got like 600 subs earlier. Wow. Holy moly. Good for raps. Oh my god. And then Faust drops another 1,200 bits and says, screw it. Have the rest. It's not like I spend them anywhere else. <laughs> well, that's the trick, you see. You can't spend bits anywhere else. But, uh, wow. Faust. Just, just keeps giving. Thank you very much, Faust. Um, right. God, that, that was an overwhelming barrage of information. Uh, what were we doing? We were going to fight the emus, weren't we? Right. So, um, they're coming in 18 hours. We've got 18 hours. What needs doing between now and then? Um, Faith is our shield. What can we do in 18 hours? Uh, hmm. Should we just get, let them do the objects. Is there anything we can do to secure this? Probably don't need any more heavy weapons. Uh, have we got any turrets? No, I still can't build turrets. Um, what have we got that can wake up the turrets from long? No, we'll have to. Who's going to be? Does any any one of these guys want to volunteer themselves as? turret awakener get the nukes I could just nuke that whole base sleepy idiot says okay you're in sleepy idiot in a couple of hours when we're nearly there we'll run you around and you shall stand on duty uh, also everyone everyone needs to love paste paste is life paste is love I love the paste num 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 Oh, the food is awful. Only paste will do. Don't want to eat the stew. Get the shipwreck too. Yeah, we could actually use use Kill Squad to go open up um, all the broken ships on the map. How many have we got? How long before the emu wars? Uh, they're coming at 8 p.m. in game time, and it's currently 9 a.m. Ah, uh, oh, Wolfled Lewis doesn't want his sheep. He wants to generously give it to someone else. Okay, we'll sort that out in a sec, dude. Uh, let's get the two melee boys up front. Uh, God, this is quite the kill squad. Um, who's got a quick firing weapon? Pulse rifle, that'll do. Who was in there? We had Vossbender, Troy Bone, Fat Beard, <laughs> Fat Beard McGee, Thomas DeWitt, uh, Captain Kerno, Epodax, Lokovic, Blazing Psycho, and Mister were all lurking in that ship. Okay, boys, get ready and open fire. Take me into battle. <laughs> Jeez. The firepower. Oh, finish researching flak on. Perfect. Um, uh, 
Okay, we did it, lads. Go and go and have a meal and uh, and some bandages. Um. Wow. Let's see if Zubal Dude can come and um, pick up all these organs. Good work. Any serious injuries? Um, oh god, yeah. Faust took a couple of bad wounds. GRBH. Uh, oh god, Scoutmaster took some wounds. Oh, yeah, that was... I thought the armor would be... Um, would be stronger than that. Okay, well, hopefully they can get prepped up for the Emu Wars. If you find one of the corpses to be a mega dude, you could preserve their body and resurrect them and capture them. Oh my god. That's very true. I hadn't even thought about that. Thank Guys, you've, you've got you've to go to bed if you're wounded. Come on. Everyone get patched up. You know the rules. Uh, get, them, get them patched up, boys. We've only got a few hours till the emus come. Do it, guys. Heal them up. Heal them up. Quick, quick, quick. God, it's so amazing having all these extra guys here just doing cleaning up. I love it. Um, right, how are they looking now? Faust is still bleeding. Oh my god, look at this. He's just bleeding all over the blooming floor. Jeez. God, we don't have enough beds, do we? Um, just get to the medical wing, sir. How's everyone else doing? You're done. You're barely wounded. You're, you're done. You're done. You're done. Right, it's just Faust. Okay. That's fine. Um, right, get over that. Okay. Any of these guys like don't really need to be in bed anymore? Oh, they're still pretty wounded. Okay. Uh, Crimson, talk to the rogue trader, please. Um... Nothing we can sell this guy. Oh, we could get some cool guns. We don't really have the cash for it, though. Oh, well. Uh, command's not working at the moment. I don't know. Sell some organs. I would if I could. I haven't had anyone who wants to buy them yet. Okay, what time is it? Oh, my God. It's, it's 9 o'clock. It's 7 o'clock. It's 7 o'clock, people. Right, that's it. That's all the, the healing time you're allowed. Everyone meet at the starport. Red alert. Red alert, people. Animals, everyone is locked in the doghouse. We are on lockdown, people. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. Right, who was it who wanted to go? Sleepy idiot. Uh, you're a little slow, actually. Sorry, dude. Uh, who's the fastest here? Oh, he got... Some of them got stoned. <laughs> Slowed them right down. Right, who's the fastest? God, they're all slow. I guess because they're in the big heavy suits of armor. Um, Suro. Suro, tea with biscuits or Joe Jagger? Who's volunteering? 
out of those three. Faust wants to go. You're the slowest Faust. I'm sorry. You're going to have to be like, um, like the, the doorstop. You're going to stand here and chop with your sword. Um... Who's got the shittest gun out of the least wounded people? I think it's Suro. I think Suro's doing it. Okay, Suro, get over that. Suro, you have the most important job of anyone today. You have to go over here and get the emus to attack you and attack the mechs. All glory for Suro. Uh, plague on the animals. Jan Rules has caught the plague! Oh. Is he? Please fix animal. Right, everyone else. Um, who's who's got the worst guns here? Um, wow, let's get on the heavy bolter. Uh, elite, get on the heavy bolter. Um, get the mini guns in there. Shishi on the Storm Bolter. We'll have Crimson on the other Storm Bolter. What does that leave us with? Um, Chukta. Faust. Faust can stand in the door. Cool Jedi can stand in the door. Um, oh god. They're coming! with biscuits get in there you've got a heavy bolter sleepy idiot get in there oh god they're coming um cat turn rules um okay zero is like halfway there oh and they're coming from down here Oh, this plan is not going to work. Um, <laughs> you like the placement of the corpse fridge next to the kill box. Yeah, it's just efficient that way. Here they come. 57 emus. Begun. The emu wars have. So they're going to... I guess they're going to pathfind, like, around here. And then in here. I was really hoping they'd come from another direction. What's the range on this turret? It might it might shoot them. What's the range on Ciro's gun? Not not a lot. Okay, Ciro, you're gonna have to take the quicker route. Um Okay. Mad Larkin. Is there even room for Mad Larkin in here? The the, the bunkers aren't big enough. Okay, this looks like a decent formation. Got one space left. Um. Miss the beginning. How's the stream? Uh, we're at a really, you're at a critical moment of the stream here. Close the door, and they will attack Suro instead. Ah. Okay, that's what we want. There we go. Okay, door is closed. Suro, are you ready? Um, you actually have some time. You can take the long way around, actually. Get to it like here. Um, okay. Why am I pointing a heavy bolter at my comrades? I don't know, Walrus, you tell me! <laughs> Jeez! <laughs> Stop fucking around. <laughs> um. Okay, Ciro is ready. He's in position. Right, out of the way, Ciro. Um, why did only that one wake up? I thought it would wake them all up. Going. Are they going to go for Suro? Oh, maybe they are. Are they 
just coming into the kill box. What are they doing? Oh, there we go. The turrets started firing at them. Is it working? I don't know what to do. They're confused. Okay, they come for Zero now. Run, Zero, run! Run! God. Oh no, it's over. It's Zero's down. He shall be forever remembered as the Emperor's finest. He did the job that no one else could. He's forced them to attack. Yes! Oh! Okay, that was good. I wanted more of them to go. But that's a good start. That's six... That's eight? Nine, ten, that's like ten... Ten emus taken care of. And the double whammy of knocking out a whole bunch of turrets. That's, like, that's a good two for one right there. Um... Okay, um, the rest are not coming in. Oh god, Zubal dude. Don't go out there, Zubal dude. Um, you are also relegated to Doghouse. Um, I could resign, could lock you into the home area. That might work. Open the door. I'm worried about opening the door because then they'll all come in. But I think we have to, don't we? No. Super dude. What are you doing? Um, I need to make a new area. Alright, you can go here, and he here, and for now that's it. Um, God, could you imagine if the tide of emus just came through there? Oh no! <gasps> they heard, they heard Zubal Dude opening a door. Oh my god. Um, shit, the tide, the tide cometh, but maybe the more will come through here. Okay, KV, get, get out of there. They're coming! Hold! This is working. They're not all coming at once. They're too spread out. Oh, this is ideal. This is exactly what we needed. A good drip, drip, drip piecemeal attack. Okay. I, don't, I honestly don't understand how the Australians managed to lose the emu war. You know, if emus are this dumb, what was the problem? Poor old Alpha Cat. <laughs> you can see Alpha Cat's like last gun never hitting. <laughs> he's just the worst. I mean, he's got brain damage. It's not his fault. Guys, our guys are going to get tired and hungry in a minute. Um, Take me into maybe battle. that's their strategy. Wait until we can't man the walls anymore. Um, yeah, the heavy bolters are actually a little too strong. They're destroying the kill box. Um, what do we do? How's, how tired and hungry is everyone? Pre everyone's getting tired and hungry. Um, how many are left? 25 emus left. Okay, they're down to 
someone's going to have to be baked. Um, he's going to be GRBH. How's he running? Not great. Um, I'm going to send Joe Jagger because he's healthy and he's not melee. I want. We've only got two decent melees, so I, I kind of need them to stem the tide. Um. Ah, they can smell him. God, these emus got good, good senses. We knew that he'd walked out. Oh, that barbed wire is so good. Wow, oh, well, there you go. Look, Alpha Cat got one. He got one. And then, oh, whoa, 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 Okay, it's the limit. You, that's the danger zone. Do not, do not stand too close to the danger zone. Okay, how many are left now? Six. Nine. Okay, um, we're gonna have to go out there, I think. All temporary boys. Assemble. This may be where it goes wrong. Okay, we're just going to power through. Charge! Oh, God. Kill box. The kill box worth works both ways. Uh, has anyone got a sidearm? Let's go, does. Get around there, dude. The emus just can't get through the armor. These guys' armor is just way too good. Oh god. Sleepy, sleepy idiot. No. The friendly fire is insane. Oh my god, Scoutmaster Chris just got iced by tea and biscuits' his heavy bolter. Oof. Okay. Right, push on. Push on to victory. Take me into battle. God, the, the cleanup. Right. Uh. Right, Izzy, can you rescue Sleepy Idiot? And KV can tend. No, give, give, him, give him a rest. Okay, here we go. Um, he's got a not good gun. Right, GRBH, you rescue Suro. Uh, everyone else, go take out those turrets. Right, the 
robots allowed back out again. And the animals are allowed back out again. Um, there's a thing under orders that lets you allow anything on the map. Ah, okay. Where's that? Well, I'll do it after this. Don't want anyone walking into gunfire just yet. Medical emergency. Ah! Oh! Zero! Can't see his stats. Right. That'll do. Come on then, guys. Line up and light it up. Oh, they can't see it. Oh, God. Okay, hang on. Um, right, take, take out the big thing. Then... The turret. Faust. Charge the light brigade. Okay. Take him out, boys. Oh, so good. So good. Right then. Uh, who died? Scoutmaster. Died to the friendly fire heavy bolter incident. Um, and that was it so far. There's only one casualty. Holy moly. Things are starving. I know, I've just let the animals out of their house. They, they just had to be locked in for the day because I didn't want to risk rogue emus. What's medical wing doing? Um, right, sleepy idiot. He's going to live. Sura the Death is going to live. <gasps> Joe Jagger's going to live. We did it. We actually did it. Oh my god. One... Man, what a KDR. You know? 57 to 1. Perfect. I mean, we had a lot of help. Let's be honest. Um, there we go. Allowed everything. Oh, we got some traders to turn up. We got the kissing detective, bored, Miss Shippen, Lumpy, Walrus, Madam, Yenus, and um, Draz Rankster. Oof. Goes from celebrate celebratory Aussie accents. No, nah, I wouldn't put them through that. No one deserves that. Uh, Skunk is walking around in a daze because of his addiction. He'll get over it. Um, combat supplies approaching. Death. There's a rogue trader in orbit. Let's talk to the trader. Oh no, they've gone. Okay. Um, Faust and Mad Larkin are both about to lose their minds. Where are they? God, fat oh my, okay, well, medical wing is a little oversubscribed. Um, sorry, guys. Never needed so many medical beds before. Um, do you want to have any spare beds? Nope. Okay. Ooh, they're using the good medicine. Oh, no. Thank you for spotting that. Whew. Okay. All right, let's send someone out to talk to the traders. 
Hold still, Lumpy. We want to trade. Krieg have wares if you have coin. Um, flag vest. Where did we get that from? Uh, what do we want? We can get rid of the bows, obviously. Don't need that. Um, keep the gladius. Get rid of those spears. Um, all this tribal shit can go. got too many brains really oh no these guys don't have much money we can't actually give them much of our stuff what have they got they've got 20 medicine we'll take that incendiary shells we don't need jump packs we don't really need I mean I guess we'll take it because why not um faith is our shield Adamantium Warhammer. That's kind of cool. Massively overpriced. Um, a missile launcher. Ooh. Uh, Gauss Blaster. Flak Pants. Icon Helmet. Prestige Power Armor. Skatari Helmet. We'll take a Guard Helmet. Sure. Now, how many organs can you guys carry? Because, I'm just saying, we got a few. Perfect. There you go. You can never have too many organs. Um, let's, let's take the missile launcher too. Even though it's a heretical chaos missile launcher, I do kind of want to see it in action. Um, perfect. Okay, yeah, we'll just give them six livers, five hearts, seven lungs. And in return, we'll get tech prints and a missile launcher. Perfect. Accept. Oh, whew. Oh, the tech prints give you XP. Remember to build the monument. Yes, that's next. The next mission is to build the monument. Oh, whoops. Didn't really want to rebuild that. Um, pods have arrived. Oh, the super hammer's here. What does it say? This warhammer is embedded with an EMP capacitor. Upon impact, it blasts the target with an EMP burst in addition to physical damage. It has an onboard persona that can bond only a single person. The wielder and intelligent weapon can synchronize their reflexes and attack with frightening speed, accuracy, and creativity. Once bonded to a wielder, the weapon's persona will refuse to be wielded by anyone else. Oh my god. That's pretty cool. Traits. Kind thoughts. Painless. What? The weapon's persona is kind and supportive. It whispers kind thoughts to whoever it is bonded with, increasing their mood. The weapon's persona has some method of physically disabling pain. The one holding the weapon will feel no pain of any kind. Oh my god. Um, so it's like, it's basically like a demonically possessed thunder hammer? That's what I'm getting from this. Um, sounds like complete heresy. Heresy of the highest order, sir. But I do want to try it out. It's got a name. It's called Kelzagalgar. That sounds like a demon name if ever I heard one. <laughs> yeah, we'll say it's got a machine spirit. Um, who's the best melee guy? It might be Cool Jedi. Oh, Alpha Cat's good too, but he's got brain damage. So not Alpha Cat. Uh, yeah, I think it's Cool Jedi. Which is perfect because Cool Jedi is a wimp. So he can't handle pain. But the hammer will make him immune to pain. It's perfect. It's definitely alpha. Uh, it's definitely cool Jedi's. Without a doubt. How about I market it? Nah. I want to see cool Jedi run around with a demonic power hammer. That sounds amazing. Is he still missing an arm? He is missing an arm. Um, but we have just built an arm. So it should be alright. So 
save it for the new guy. Oh, we could. But he's already got the pain reduction, right? Um, skunk. He's tough. Oh, doesn't that do reduce pain? Just reduces damage. Hmm. I'll have a think. Right, what do we need to do here? There's a lot of work to be done. Um, I think we need another servo skull. Oh, we also need to... We need more room in the corpse fridge. Let's get rid of that coffin. For starters. And we have to put the monument down in a minute. So I'm thinking... Deconstruct all of this. Um, mine all of that out. The new guy will be better with it. Yeah, probably. Oh god, roof collapse. Oh, I always forget about this. Um Doesn't need a roof, guys. Just don't put a roof on a little bit of wall. Jeez. Faith is our shield. Combat supplier. Uh, flak armor's done. Ooh. Okay, what, what's, what do we want to do now? Carapace armor? That could be pretty cool. What's a good tech at this point? What do you guys think? Um, could do mortars, because we've got nukes. Um, we could, we could get the bigger turrets. Uh, how do you get those? Like the the stubborn the auto turrets. Which tech is that? Imperial turret technology. I think we need auto turrets. <laughs> we need to research heretical inclinations because of the demon weapon. <laughs> I think heretical inclinations just opens up um like xenotech. I think it lets us, like, build, like, shuriken catapults and pulse lasers and stuff. Sonic weapons. I'm not super interested. Um, maybe Meat Rocket Spirit is within the hammer. Oh, I hope so. I hope so. Yeah, we're going to go for turrets. Um... Oh, everyone's leaving. Bye, guys. Thank you for killing all the emus. I want another servo skull as well. Um, oh, they haven't even finished the power core yet. Oh, Alpha Cat's building it. Jeez. I bet, I bet it ain't broke. There we go. We got five power cores already. Oh, my dingus. All right, so what actually do we need for the for a new servo skull? Got a brain, got loads of power cores, four components to ceramite. We got the ceramite. Oh, we got everything. We got it all. Perfect. Okay. Um servo skulls do. The ones I've got at the moment can just do hauling and cleaning, but you can get higher tech ones that can do more things. But to be honest, if the servo skulls are doing all the cleaning, that means everyone else can, like, do the important work. 
I'm absolutely fine with that. So, um, where's the monument? Here it is. God, it's so big. Okay. We'll have to deconstruct this as well. All right, we'll leave this running for a bit. We'll clear out this space, we'll build a new wall, build the monument there. And while that's happening, I'm going to read out your messages because I am so far behind on these. Um, excuse me. Um, where are we? Durpledor donated and says, petitioning for the Bemperor to bestow the Omnicized Blessing upon the monkey. We'll do that. We'll get the mod on for next week. Let me write it on the um, thing. Bye on... Um, D Parsec donates and says, I'm glad you're doing well in the UK. Oh, we did read this one. But uh, yeah, the, the link didn't come through, D Parsec. I uh, would like to see it though. Thank you. Um, Lockvik says, Hail Bemperor, this game drives me nuts. I crashed a shuttle, then built fortifications around it, um, like I've seen you do. Then I attacked it. Out comes a dreadnought that fires one volley of rockets and kills three quarters of my people in one shot. Oh my god, Lockvik. I'm lucky I haven't seen a dreadnought yet. Um, that sounds Faith proper scary. Oh, we got another servo skull. I'm going to put it in here. It'd be like the hauling, hauling bot. Can Wowrus, can you do that? Perfect. And then... Get it charged up. Activate. Robots. Servo skull 2. This one shall be... Um, this is... Summers. 33. Deploy Server Skull. Off he goes. Alright, maybe we need to turn these into auto doors. Have we even researched auto doors yet? No, we haven't. Alright, auto doors are next. Because this is insane. Um, especially with all this crap outside we need to, to bring in. Oh, Faust is still here. And Suro, they're having a good rest before they go home. Good for them. Oh yeah, rename the sheep. Thank you. Is Zoof. Welcome, Zoof. You are a ram now. 27% of its wool. What's the deal with the temp people? I think when they're healed up, they're just going to go home. They were only here to help fight the emus. But I also like got them to kill the mechs and one of the ships down here as like a side project. But that wasn't really what they were here for. I don't think I can hire them in. I could try and capture them. But that would make the blue sovereignty very sad. Which I don't really want to do. Because uh, I think we're on quite good relations with them. Where are they? Plus five. And if I make them sad, then I can't go higher up in ranks and get more psychic powers. <laughs> Arrest Zero so you can be our forever friend. No! Don't remove the roof, just, just do this. Uh, Antibrad used channel points. He did, but I assumed he wanted a person with those channel points, so I'm saving one of these uh, prisoners for him. Um, where are we at? 26 resistance on that guy, 28 on that. It's going to take a while, though. Where did you go? Sorry, you're here. You're in bed. There you are. A new quest. Uh, they want us to get hives. They will give us some stuff. Um, I don't know if I want any of that stuff. I think I'll not bother.
Oh, is that bio-coded? Oh, it is bio-coded, boo. Walls first floor, yeah, obviously. Oh my god, Faust! Faust! What are you doing? Stop! Holy shit, Faust. Thank you for giving out another 20 gift subs. How many is that now? Faith is our shield. That's a lot, is what it is. Well, you just pushed me straight into a level 5 hub train immediately. Holy moly. That's amazing. Thank you, Faust. Faith is our shield. <laughs> tax return, Baron. <laughs> Is is it a kinky tax return? Faith is our shield. Right, where were we? Um Rat Goblinoid donates and says, Bon! Fun still our esteem stream the other day. How did it end? I'll tell you what, go to Faith Remy's channel. Remy Remy's YouTube channel. He's made a, a cut down video of the of the end of the stream because he took over after me and Spiff stopped. So go check out Rumi's channel. I haven't had time to watch it yet, but I'm going to. Um, and that's where it's at. Faith is our shield. But thank you, Rat Goblinoid. Um, is some Warhammer with Tom and Tom planned in the future? Maybe. He, like, Spiff says he likes Warhammer. And I think I think he likes me. Faith so, is our um, shield. I don't see why not. Nothing planned, but I definitely think it's, it's certainly possible. And I'd like to. Uh, Zubal Dude donates $20. Thank you, Zubal Dude. It says, Great Bamperer! I watched the last two weeks from the pile due to work, but wanted to express Faith my thanks for looking after my confused, frail self as long as you could. Now I must re enter the world of reincarnation, the wheel of reincarnation, and hope for something sturdier. Well, Zubal Dude, tell you what, there's nothing much sturdier Faith than what you shield. are now. Even in death, you still serve us, Zubal Dude. As a beep boop, beep boop, beep boop. Your brain has been reintegrated. And it's just better. It's better than it ever brain was. Look at it go. What a good brain. Getting work done. Uh, right. Now the monument. Faith is our shield. Oh my god, it's still too, it's too big. It won't even fit. Um, okay. Like, Faith is mine, our mine this out. Um, have we actually got anyone dedicated to mining? Um, well, we can definitely turn the cleaning Faith down on everyone. Now that we've got two servo skulls running around. Um, Right, yeah, anyone who can mine, get on it. Faith is our shield. Uh, Sira the Death donates and says, Where are my Namasis Halberd? Oh, one day, man. One day we'll get there, but we're still quite far. Um, Sergeant Oddball donates and says, Ben, finally taking some, pit some pics of my six mil World War II Brits to show off. Two squadrons of Cromwells with challengers, because why would you take Cromwells with fireflies? I don't know. I'm particularly happy with the stowage. What are your thoughts? Let's have a look. Oh, tiny toys. Tiny toys. Faith is our shield. Tiny toys are better toys. Oh my god, I love them. I love the bases as well. They look great. Oh, six mil. Six mil is best Faith mil. Is our shield. Let them go. Yeah, the storage really helps actually break up the, um, the green as well. You know what I mean? Like all these little black bits and little brown bits, just like break it up a bit, add some nice detail. Awesome, Faith man. Is our I love them. Have you got any infantry? Or is it just tanks for now? Oh, little binoculars! Faith is our shield. Yeah, man, these are really cool. 
Oh, you're making me want to want to get more tiny toys. Oh, awesome, man. Thank you for sharing. You got some infantry yet, but not painted. Cool. Tiny tonks. Doe-eyed monkeys. Cadians want us to look after two more monkeys for six days. They have blood rot and require regular treatment. Um, ugh, I don't want any of those things. No, thank you. You said painting tiny toys would be quick. You've been painting 10 millimeter wood elves. They would be quick, but there's hundreds of the buggers. <laughs> yeah. I mean, some, some tiny toys are, are easier to paint than others, right? Tiny space marines are easy because they're just mainly one color. And same with like World War II guys, generally. Just like, you know, do the green, brown gun, pink face. Um, but yeah, wood elves, there's a bit more going on there. That is harder work. Faith is our shield. Uh, right, where are we? Thank you, Sergeant Oddball. Keep it up, they look great. Uh, Wolf Lord Lewis donates and says, Ben, I'm here early. Here's my two recent projects, a tech marine and a Phobos librarian. Uh, as for what I showed last week, I'm going to run it as a Centurion. Ah, that makes sense. Cool. Okay, let's have a look. It's Wolf Lord Lewis's. Um, what have we got? Old school Tech Marine boy. Very nice. I like their, like, um, segmented armor. Which makes them look really chunky. Uh, oh, there's his Robo Arm. Very cool. Is he the Forge World one? I think he is. Looks great. I like that model. And the librarian. Oh my god. Very bloody. Look at that. But, uh, the problem with this... I like this librarian model, but I saw someone um, Photoshop it with a fedora tipping the tip and just going like, m'lady. And now I can't unsee that. Every time I see this model, I just think of him as, as tipping his fedora. And I can't take him seriously anymore. But he's still very cool. I like that model a lot. Thank you, dude. Uh, Koroshenko donates. and says, Greetings, mighty Bempra. Do you happen to know about the Imperial Titan Castigore? It was an AI-controlled Titan that fell to chaos. Uh, it has a Gatling gun that shoots demons. Also, here's some money for the Optimus Prime Fund. Kremlo came from space! I have not heard of the Castigore Titan. Uh, I will check it out. Maybe there's a lore hammer in that. Um, or is it Castigator rather than Castigore? Because that's what's coming up. Um... I'll have to Google that later. Try and find it. Thanks for the tip. Uh, Dagow donates. Thank you, dude. And says, good afternoon, Mr. Ben. We're off on another adventure again. I've been playing some Mechanicus this week with my new Admech fever recently. Here's the pics that I promised for my first try at painting. Also, my colony I forgot before. Oh, man. Mechanicus is a great game. If you're into 40k and turn-based tactics... You should check out Mechanicus. It is really good fun. Um, let's have a look at your painty boys. Okay, little Admec boy. Oh, man, for your first ever model, that's really good. They look great, man. Uh, yeah, good, nice glowy, glowy lenses look great. Color scheme's really cool. I like the sort of like burnished bits, so it's not all just silver. You've got a bit of um bit of variation on the metal there. Very cool. I like that a lot. And then your colony. What am I looking at here? Oh my god, it's very neat. You've done all the floors, even the out 
outdoor floors. Oh my god, it's so neat and ordered. You've got like your proper power station, your proper rec room. Very organized. So you've even got like a medical storage room. God, how many hours in are you on this playthrough? Looks great. <laughs> Too many. <laughs> oh, thanks for sharing. They're really cool. Uh, Scoutmaster Chris donates and says, I managed to get myself from the Vod Goblin pile to send a dono for the Emperor. Please add me to the list of names for damnation. Oh, I did. You're the, literally the only guy that died, Scoutmaster. Oof. Riddled with heavy bolter shells while fighting an emu hand to hand. I hope, I hope that's exactly what you wanted. Why wouldn't it be? Oh god, they're taking a while to get all this mined, aren't they? Um, Chakana has donated and says, Sub and dono virginity now lost. Thanks for keep all the great content. Keep it up, brother! You're welcome. Thank you so much for the support. You're welcome. Uh, GRBH donates and says... I don't know which way around this one is. Here we go, this way. It says, um, the blast threw Meat Rocket to the ground. Getting up, he checked his hip. Fire everywhere. The gun was gone, but the knife was still there. Strangely calm, he cut down two enemies and saw a shot from Crimson Third. Oh, saw, saw a shot from Crimson drop a third. The tide of the battle was turning. Someone was screaming in the flames. Meat Rocket ran back in, holding out a gun and wounded Jedi. But pulling, pulling out a gun and wounding Jedi. A bullet slicing through his side in the process. With Jedi in cover, pushed approaching Crimson aside and raised the gun for one last shot. The battle was won. Oh my god, you're right. That's like the epic retelling of the death of Meat Rocket. He went out like an absolute hero, totally saving the day. Take me into battle. Like, we should never forget the glorious, glorious sacrifices of Meat Rocket Wargasm. We'll have to build a statue to him. Can we do that yet, or do we have to research it? Can't remember. I think we have to research it before we can build it. Uh, where are my other miners at? Uh, cool Jedi. No, he's there. He's doing it. Where is this going to go? Like, here, I think? So what we can probably do... We could probably cancel a lot of this, actually. I probably don't need any of that. Um, and how much rock have we got? Sandstone, okay. Uh, so we'll go out here. Build like wall number one. Okay. There we go. Um, HL Mad Larkin donates fifteen dollars. Thank you very much. It says Bond, my absolute favourite stream of the week. Chump me up, brother. Additionally, I know it's a huge investment, but rush that planetary extractor because it basically allows you to keep up with the difficulty of the mods. Ooh, okay. I mean, it's a big one. I was going to wait till I had like one of those things that gives you a free tech. Um, where is it? Uh, I've forgotten where it is already. That one. It's 10,000 tech. It's like, oh, it's a lot. Oh god, skunk's gone berserk. Beep boop, don't mind me. Beep boop boop. Oh no, don't beat up Summers! <gasps> oh, okay, this, this is not okay. You can't beat up the servo bots. Walrus will come. Oh, okay. Didn't need to. Good work, everyone. Uh, 
take me into uh, battle. Hentai Bunny donates and says, Bon, hi. I would like to throw you some thrones for the chance to get a guy named Ian Watson, if possible, <laughs> with the title Sewer Goblin. I love your content. Okay, let me um, let me change your name to Ian Watson Sewer Goblin. You got it. Thank you. <laughs> oh God, what's happening? Ah, cougar. <gasps> Oh, the cougar. It ate pasta bus. Oh, oh little pasta bus. Good work, Kurashishi. Bringing it down. How did the cougar get in? <gasps> Someone destroyed that bit of wall. How did that happen? Must have, like, started to starve to death and, like, busted its way out. Nearly, nearly ready to get that monument in. Uh, yeah, that'll do it. Faith is our shield. <laughs> right, where'd we get it? Gustavus the second says, "Hello, Ben. I've had a very bad day, but your streams." are always a great way for me to relax, and they make me very happy. Keep up the good work. Oh well, thank you, Gustavus. I'm really glad I can help you. Thank you for the support. Um, Sleepy Idiot donated. I didn't leave a message, but it was very generous. Thank you, Sleepy Idiot. Um, Joe Jagger donates $30, which is super generous. Thank you, Joe Jagger. and says, making up for missing yesterday's stream. Any chance to be sculled up so that I can clean everyone's filth for the Bemperor? Oh... What, did Faith I did I get you in? Uh, did I make you one of the um one of the army mans? Well, I'll make a note next to your name, and maybe we can get a um another skull going in a little bit, because they are pretty useful. All right, I'm also going to start getting decent armor for us. Um, we need an armor fabricator. Which needs ten components. How many have we got? Two. Right, so let's get some more of those going. And we also need um the bionic arms. I think the bionic arms are both ready. Yep, we've got two bionic arms. So who was it? It was a cool Jedi who was missing one? Yeah, left arm. Um, right, cool, Jenna's got one, and who else was it? Take wow, me into battle. Which one is that? Right hand. There you go. Two Bionic Arms coming right up. We'll even free up the special medicine for you. How very kind. Oh, well, Sura is all healed up. Off he goes. You were a hero, Sura. You really killed a lot of, lot of emus and mechs. Good work, sir. Anything else worth salvaging over there? No, looks pretty clear. That's all clear. Good, good, good. Um, right, where do we get to? Let me update my, my reader. I'm going to take a break in a sec. I'm really thirsty. Run out of water. Okay, updated. Um, yeah, I'm going to take five actually. So we'll just pause it here. Uh, everyone, grab a drink, have a pee, and I will be back in a moment. Bam, we're back. Oh, how you doing? I feel a lot better. Is that a door kicker marine? Yeah, yeah, that break screen is a door kicker marine. Doesn't it look amazing? I need to put a credit on there. I keep forgetting. I keep meaning to put the um, Twitter handle, the, uh, the amazing artist who did it on. But I keep forgetting. I'll try and do it for next week. Um, 
Right, what are we doing? Uh, oh, right, it's the um, it's time for the Fate time for the surgery. It's bionic arm day for everyone. Do I really need four doors? Well, apparently, if I don't, four doors means that um, no one want, that no one pathfinds through here, and the baddies come in this way. That's the theory behind the four doors. Oh my god, Naren Lord the Squig just eating the corpses. Look at him go. Nom, 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 nom. That's going to keep him busy, isn't it? Uh, oh, there we go. Don't botch it. Don't botch it. Perfect. Walrus is back in action. Bionic arm, bionic leg. Um, how's... No, no. Hang on. There we go. That's more like it. Okay. Fingers crossed. Uh, he's okay! Oh. Finished Imperial turret technology, but we didn't get the heavy stubber turrets. Uh, okay, we need the auto sentry turrets, I guess. Um. All right, what are we building this palace out of? We should probably get the walls up first before we worry about the palace. Um, how much sandstone have we even got? Let's get a whole bunch of sandstone while we're here. Oh, we can't. Uh, no, cancel that. Um, 176. Two, three, four. No, finish. Finish your job. You can ha you've nearly done that. Just there you go. Um, how long before the monument needs to be done? Um. We've got quite a long time. T 24 days. It's fine. Uh, plague. Dagal's got the plague now. Dan Rules had it earlier. Uh, is he alright now? Yeah, he's alright. You just recently found out I play Armada. Do I plan on buying any of the Clone Wars stuff? I haven't played Armada for a while now. Um, like two years or something. I still love it, but I just haven't kept up with the latest stuff. Uh, mainly because I can't play right now. I haven't been able to play for over a year. What is this? We've got 11 humans with... Long lads, revolvers, sniper rifles, grenades, molotovs, auto pistols. Uh, we've got invisible baby, beanie, Letus saxonicum, Take me into battle. squint, TNT trash, snaz, revelation, lover, missy, big dino gaming, and kitan have come. Oh, along with Benny Dem and Bear Willis. Uh, that's quite a lot of guys. 13 boys. I'm glad that outer wall's done. Um, I 
let's cancel these hall orders. Come back inside. Are they coming straight away? Who are they even coming from? Pirates from the Whips. Um, hmm. How much time have we got? They don't seem to be attacking straight away. Yeah, I don't know. The mod command is broken. I'm not sure why. Um, I haven't changed it. Should still be working. Check stream labs. Um, is it bot? Bot. 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 Ah, bot. Okay. Probably just copy and paste it if if I can find it. Um, Here it is. Uh, yeah, it says it's working, but it's not. There you go. The bot only works sometimes. Huh. Well, there you go. That's the mod list. Um, okay, right. Oh, look, there's three ship chunks out here. It's handy. Alright, just gonna keep an eye on these suckers. Okay, they're coming. Saddle up, cowboys. All animals into the doghouse. Um, uh, oh, Alpha Cat. You're not going to make it, Alpha Cat? Heavy bolters. Oh, the squig. Look at him go. That's right. Get out of here. Oh, no. Zubal dude. Oh, not Zubal dude. Squint, you... Son of a gun. Uh, Crimson. Is this guy worth capturing? The brawler. Oh, good at crafting and intellectual. Maybe we do want to capture this guy. Um. Oh, he's never going to make it. He lost both his legs. Um, and his arm shredded. He's a stump. He's just a stump now. Um, uh, finish, finish him off. Oof. That could have been worse. I feel like these guys should be able to hover over the barbed wire. Oh well, can't complain, they're really good. Right, how bad? How bad are the wounds? Kurushishi's she's gonna be fine. Uh Oliet is gonna be fine. Alpha Cat's gonna be fine. Waris is gonna be fine. Clean up first.
Okay. No, please. Cool Jedi medic? Okay, fine. Go for it. There's a squig in my base. <laughs> there is a squig. He's a good boy. Uh, right. One out. Uh, right, where did I get to? Some more messages to read. I've got Summers. He says, can I have repairs, please? I, last time I tried to repair a servo skull, I got bugged. So, honestly, I don't know if you can. Um, if I deactivate you... You go back to base, and then I hit repair bot. Should take nine... Nine bits. Let's get Kurashishi to do it. See if it actually works. Uh, well, maybe it is going to work. Uh, activate. There you go. Oh, Zubal Dude also damaged. Let's send you back. Zubal Dude nearly died. That's serious business. Um, prepare this robot. 29 Ceramite, jeez. That's quite a lot. Oh, this is an inefficient path. Um... Stick a door in here. Right then. Um, Benny Dem donates ten dollars. Thank you, Benny Dem, and says, "Bad, I've drastically overslept again." Oh well. Here's my Deathwing Redemptor Dreadnought. I'm almost done with. He just needs some fancy bits. Um, time to raid the bits box. Let's have a look. I like dreadnoughts. One of my favourite things. Uh, bam! Benny Dem's dread. Looking cool. Oh man, not quite goblin green. Going for like a lime green rim. Experimental. He's looking cool though. God, I love dreadnoughts. They're just big chunky boys. Stomp, stomp, stomp. What kind of bits are you going to stick on him? You can get like some... Uh, Really good, like Dark Angel symbols and purity seals and stuff. Yeah, looks great, man. Good job. Plus, you've painted your base, so I can't even complain. Thanks for sharing. Um, Pepperfruit Pesto has donated and says, Ben. I did not notice you started playing RimWorld until recently. I've been catching up on the VODs, but still lagging behind. I started playing it myself, too. Sucks you right in. Wheel me up for the Krieg, if possible. Wow, you are on the wheel, sir. Thank you. It is one of those games that just sucks in your life. I think that's one of the um, best things about streaming it. Is uh, it limits how much time I can spend. <laughs> means it takes a while, but also means I don't just blitz through it in like a couple of weeks. Okay, that turret area is, is nearly done. Um, so we need to do the same, like over here. Get a couple of... Uh, uh, get like a mini turret in here. Apparently this, I've been told, this will stop them from uh, trying to pathfind through the walls. Uh, they won't dig through this wall to get into my base, because they, they'll detect that their turret will shoot them as soon as they pop through. So instead, they'll come in the e easy way and get murdered. Such is the dream. Oh god, we should get back on the organs. Uh, 
I've run out of sandstone. Okay. Uh, limestone it is. Summers donates again and says, I'm a lean, mean, cleaning machine, ready to servo. <laughs> we need to kick ass and carry stuff. And I'm all out of feet. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you, dude. Uh, Glyphu donates and says, I missed the beginning of the stream, but I wanted to say that your colony looks great. Also, if you can get a guy doing large wooden sculptures forever, you can make some quick cash. After 10 art, they can make some great metal sculptures too. Ah, that's good to know. Actually, that reminds me. We've got an art trainer. Are any of these guys actually good at art? And I can give them the trainer. No. All our artists died. Boo. Take me into battle. Uh, but we do have a miner trainer, don't we? So who's good at mining? Uh, cool Jedi. Is Cool Jedi can have the, the mining trainer. Where is it? Am I being blind? Ah, there it is. Cool Jedi. Here's the trainer. Um, have we got anything else I can use? What's this thing? The melee trainer. I think Cool Jedi can have that too, can't he? Because then he can be the hammer man. Let's do it. Where's the hammer? Um, am I being blind? Faith is our shield. It's in there somewhere. Oh, there it is. Okay, the possessed thunder hammer. It's cool Jedi's now. Oh, he's gonna need some armor, some really good armor. Um. Cool Jedi. Most of these guys can attack. Uh, any of these guns good? It's been a while since I've had like a restock on like equipment. The cool Jedi's got good guns. Um Probably give him a slightly better auto pistol. I can't imagine they're going to use it very often. Um, Alpha Cat needs a sword, actually, don't they? Um, now you can have Meat Rocket's old Ceramite Gladius. Perfect. Kurashishi still got the. Um, charge rifle. Seems to be doing a good enough job. Walrus has got a bolt pistol and a gladius. Must have something better than that, right? Hang on, they dropped they dropped their hammer. Uh, oh god, cool Jedi, you're wearing literally nothing but a vest? Why? Wear the jumpsuit at least, dude. Um, Alright, we're gonna need to get you some more... some more armor. Let's finish this. Armor Fabricator is online. It's the best stuff we can make. Um, Drill Guard Flak Armor. Seems like the best thing we can actually make. 
does it cost? 60 steel, 30. Does it have to be Devil Strand? That seems a bit mean. Um. Yeah, apparently it does. The fuck? Okay. Uh, light flak armor? What does that need? <laughs> okay, cloth, steel, and compact. It's fine. Uh, let's make some light flak armor. And what do the helmets need? Spiky Creek helmet. 40 steel, 10 ceramite. Regular Creek helmet. Same. Well, spiky helmet it is, of course. Um... Oh, we got some guys. Go trade with them. Uh, yeah, so thank you. Thank you, Glithu. Um Hopefully we'll get an artist soon. Um, Ickland says, Ben, uh, to make up my hoard of unpainted gobbos, I have some based 30k and my speed-painted son of malice. Here is a photo. Uh, let's have a look. Ickalant's. Um Ooh. Very cool. Oh yeah, man, he looks great. Nearly based. Gotta do the rim too. The rim's part of the base. Oh man, and that's like a like a dark mechanicus army? Or regular mechanicus, I'm not sure. They look awesome. I love the bases and the purple. Oh god, as if those robots weren't creepy enough. <laughs> you had to paint creepy clown faces on them. <laughs> oh. oh my god, look at those guys. Oh, that's such a good idea. Yeah, the ghosts make great, like, creepy Mechanicus monsters. Good thinking. Got your Katari Peltasts. Looking cool. Those boys. Yeah, man, great army. I love it. I've always been tempted to do a Mechanicus army myself. They're just so weird. Man, how many points is all of that? Oh, you got Night Lords too. Awesome. Yeah, they look awesome, man. I'm sort of too scared to try and do those lightning bolt effects. Well, they came out great. Cool. Thanks for sharing, man. Good stuff. Um, right. These guys have got, like, no money. I'll take their medicine. Um, oh, and I'll take the servo arm. Sweet. Um, and then you can take my livers. And a heart. You can give me some meals. Perfect. Nice doing business with you, uh, Finn Diesel. Okay, where'd we get to? Uh, Anjolo has donated and says, Ben, I've been painting my Necrons while listening to your stream. And I've just finished. It's really helped with brush cleaning. Wash out the brush every three minutes or every time I hear a metal break. <laughs> a mental break or a crisis sound. <laughs> I hope you like. That's a good idea. Nice and regular brush cleaning. Very important. Oh god, hang on. Slow down. Slow down while we look at these models. Um, boop. Ah, oh, yeah. They look great, man. It's nice to see Necron something other than silver. This guy's just getting like fucking... 
slurped. Slurp that man. Yeah, man. They're really cool. Love it. Yeah, really, really clean. Really nice. And great bases. Yeah, it's really simple and effective color scheme, actually. It works really well. They're nice and grimy. They look like they've been, you know, not cleaned for a long time. Awesome. Proper space skellies. God, you got loads. Yeah, you should be really proud of these, man. It's an awesome army. Oh, no. No bases. See the whole army. Uh, oh, you're so close to being finished. Just those bases. <laughs> that's all that you need. <laughs> yeah, that's a fantastic army, dude. Good job. Very cool. Alright then. Looks like one of the one of the prisoners has joined. Um, which one is it? He's an iron-willed misogynist. Gross. Good at melee and crafting. And I'm not bad at medical. Right, medical, crafting, melee. I'm trying to remember that. Um, uh, craft, craft, craft. Okay. That, that makes more sense. Okay, then they need to learn to love the paste. Which they do. They can wear anything they want. Have we got a jumpsuit for them, maybe? They need a better weapon than a knife. Give them a power sword. Have they got any shooting skills at all? Not really. Well, we can give them a sidearm revolver. Why not? Oh, you're just going with the shorts and gas mask look, are you? Um, <laughs> can you not? Do you, like, wear something that will keep you warm? <laughs> Jeez. I need to get some more trench coats going. Not enough for everyone. Right, so we need to um, we should name this boy. And it was Anti Brian. Anti Brian, what did you want to be called again? I forgot. Chief Scribe something. Um, ah, that's it. Can't copy paste. Boo. Oh, there's not enough room. Artinius the third. I have to remember that he's chief scribed. Um perfect. Done. Uh, which means we can like seal that back up. Right, we should do the same here and here. Then we can start doing this. Limestone wall. happening. Oh no. Where is it? Oh god, it's not in the base. Thank god. How many is it? Um, 
God, it's a lot of them. Six hives. Okay. So let's... Well, this one needs to be home. Home zoned. Alright then, for now, everyone's going to have to stay at home. Um, in case someone walks near one of those. Oh, and the robots too. I'm going to have to get some more limestone as well. At some point. Uh, any nearby? Or do we literally get it all? Right. Um, thank you, Angelo. We've got Faust. Faust! What the hell, Faust? He's also donated a hundred dollars. I missed that in the barrage of other things he was doing. Faust MD. Holy moly. Single-handedly paying for the entire stream on his own. Um, you maniac, Faust. I, well, I have to give you a guy, don't I, for that? I guess you get this guy, if if we can ever get him recruited. Um one day. One day we'll get him. And he says, Ben, I dug my way to the top of the Vod Goblin pile to to show my appreciation for one of my top two favourite yogs. I must away. The dick ball approaches the Vod Goblin pile and things are about to get sticky. <laughs> oh my god, Faust. You crazy man. And I love it. Thank you very much. I hope... I very much hope you can afford it. And you're some... Billionaire oil tycoon or something. Thank you very much. Alpha Cat is no longer incapable of walking. I didn't I didn't know they were incapable of walking. What? Right, are we gonna, gonna try and deal with these How long have we got till they spawn again? Three and a half days before infestation spreads. Um Hmm. Oh god, one of them died. Why did it die? Hmm. Okay. What is that? Five big ones. Eight medium ones. Fucking hell, that's a lot of bugs. Um. Why have we still got all of this stuff lying around? Where are these robots? What are they doing? Standing. Not doing anything. Why not? They are in the area, right? Yeah, they're in the allowed area. Uh, where's Zubal Dude? Also standing. Standing by. Uh, body storage full. Oh, wow. Yeah, you're right. Body storage is full. It's because we don't have a pack of 20 dogs eating all the corpses anymore. This would have only lasted a few days. Back when we had 20 Yorkshire Terriers. Hmm. Um... Okay, well, we need to deal with the spiders. Who's the fastest runner? Someone like 
bait them in. Alright, everyone, everyone go get some food. And then we fight. Gun again. Jeez, Alpha Cat, come on. Uh, oh, before I forget, uh, another one over here. Okay, um, Uh, could someone get Ben's opinion on the Humble 40k bundle? I didn't know there was one. Um, Humble bundle. Let's have a look. Uh, what's in it? Oh, it's like an Imperial Guard uh, book collection. Um... I haven't read any of these. Uh, I should show this on screen, shouldn't I? Uh, so, what is it? You get... How much is that? What's the cost? Well, let's start at the top. So what, you get 72p for six Imperial Guard novels. Well, that sounds like a no-brainer. If you're going to even read one of them, that's an absolute bargain. Um... If you like ebooks, I'm not a big fan. I'd rather have the real book, but that's just me. Um, and then another seven pound twenty to get eight more books. I've not read any of these either. Um, and then another thirteen pounds for these twelve more books, of which. I haven't read any of them either. These are all basically newer books. I've not read a like a modern 40k book for a while. Um, oh, I've read Brothers of the Snake. There's one book I've read out of like 20. Um, I mean, whew, 13 pounds is a bit more, but it's still an incredible amount of books. So it sounds like a great deal. If you're going to read them, then yeah, seems like a good deal. Um. But I can't tell you if any of these are any good. I've not even heard people talk about a lot of them. Um, yeah, Brothers of the Snake I thought was okay. It's not not bad. It's got the first first chapter. It's like three three separate short stories, and the first one I thought was a fun premise, and I wish they'd done more with it. The other two were just kind of okay. Um, yeah, sorry man, I haven't really got any opinions. I've just not read any of them. But seems like a like a pretty good deal. You get like 12, 20, 26 books for like 15 pounds. Can't argue with that. And it goes to charity as well. So who can complain? Yeah, well thanks for letting me know. That's good. Good deal. But I imagine at least half of them are probably complete trash. Like the bad, the bad 40k books are, are bad. Um, so you know, they're not all winners. Right, what are we doing? We're gonna kill some bugs. The only good bug is a dead bug. Um, who's the fastest runner? Uh, got a lot of decent runners actually. Pretty much everyone. Okay. Um, right, get on it then, guys. Um, and then you 
you to get Take back. Me into battle. Go. Um. Let's send a cool Jedi. Well, he hasn't got a gun. We'll need to be someone with a gun to bait them. Um. Kurashishi. Pretty quick. Okay, come on. Junk, 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 junk. Yep, that got their attention. Run! Run! Oh god. Robots. In the doghouse. Or just, no, stay in the animal area. Or that. Uh, indoors. Go to the indoors area. Doing summers. This barbed, barbed wire, so good. Oh, summers for fuck's sake. Um. Jeez, Summers, you just literally got yourself killed. Please. Please! Um. Right, actually, guys, get off the heavy weapons. So the friendly fire isn't insane. Oh, we live! Man, none of the humans even got injured. Pretty good. Oh, Walrus picked up the servo arm. I'm not sure it's he's the one for it. What does it do? 25% uh, work speed. Reduced shooting accuracy. Extra move speed. Okay. It's not for you, Walrus. Or maybe it is, actually. You're a good crafter, right? Yeah. Yeah, you can just do extra extra fast crafting with your servo arm. Perfect. Why is there a... Who left their shirt on the floor? Don't forget the hives. Oh, I did forget the hives. Thank you. Okay, we'll let everyone have a rest. And then we'll go back out there. Well, they can all have some dinner. Um, I should just get Cool Jedi to go out there. Just get some hammering in. Blam, blam. Bam. Easy. All right, everyone can go back out again now. We need to get some extra crafting on as well. Um, right, those helmet. Oh, yeah, everyone's just grabbed the random armor I've made. It's not for random people. It's for cool Jedi. Who's wearing the armor I made? Faith is our shield. Huh, who is wearing it?
weird. Uh, oh, because I didn't make it, that's why. Have we run out of cloth? Oh, I don't have to grow more cloth. Um, it's probably a bit late for cloth as well. I haven't even got time to grow any. Um, I haven't grown any cloth for so long because I didn't think I needed it. Uh, what do we need for Devil Strand, anyway? It's probably hydroponics. Oh, I haven't even researched it. Right. Uh, limestone table masterwork. Perfect. Got a new quest. Uh, mechanoid Swarm. Distract it. Um, we shall receive 10 honor or pittance. Is it centipede, two lancers, a scyther, a high shield, a drop beacon, an inferno turret, two mini slugger turrets. No, we're not doing that for 10 honor. Fuck yourselves. Jeez. Someone will die fighting that. Searching? Oh, the auto sentry turrets. Perfect. What's wrong with cool Jedi? Hates his environment. Uh, right, where are we at? Uh, uh, Ash the Stampede has donated and says, Hail, mighty Pemperor. I've succeeded. Surviving another full orbit of our homeworld around the local star. It's my birthday! <laughs> Thank you, Ash the Stampede. Happy birthday. You know, you want men to get the presents, not me. You're doing birthdays wrong, Ash. Well, thank you. Um, Salsa has donated and says, I'm crawling out of the pile to throw shiny rocks at Star King Bemperor. Please add me to the list. You've got it, Salsa. Thank you. All uh, right, auto sentry turrets complete. So that means now we need to go back and get Devil Strand. So we can make... Who'd thought Imperial Guard Armour needed Devil Strand, eh? Oh, Heat Wave. Ooh. Ah, a Trader. Perfect. Um, what are Fio components? Advanced computing energy directing machinery. Miniaturized and hardened for the most demanding applications. Oh, it's Tau shit. Right, okay, fine. Um, compact weaponry, specialized limbs, artificial intelligence, artificial metabolism, rather. Uh, that. God, I can sell them all of this shit, though. Get the livers and the hearts. Um, Anton, aesthetic nose, aesthetic shaper, psychic reader. Don't need any of that. Oh, give me something good. Where is all those, like, really expensive stuff? Why are you holding out on me? I have a telescope. Sure. Um, oh, a statue. Should we have a, a statue dedicated to Meat Rocket Wargasm? That'll make everyone happy. Uh, we'll just sell a bunch of lungs. We've got lungs for days. Uh, is this any good? Neuroquake. What does Neuroquake do? Casting this takes three hours of meditation. And afterwards, they'll go into a three-day psychic coma. The disturbing neuroquake echoes will inflict pain on everyone for many kilometers around, causing diplomatic consequences for all factions. What? That sounds fucking horrendous. It's got to be heresy. Uh, what does Skip Shield do? 
reflects all incoming ground level objects. Oh. That's kind of cool. Buy a skip shield. Why not? Um... Get rid of that yow yow before someone snorts it. And the go juice. Um, and the tea. I guess we'll buy your components. And those components. Um, and then we'll give you more organs. God, what are they doing with all these organs? Perfect. So we'll all needs hauling, boys. Tell us get and go outside, can't I? Pretty sure we can. Um, and a uranium statue to the Astra Militarum. Looks like an Inquisition symbol. Um, where does this want to live? I have to think about that. He's got inspired recruitment. Are they any good at recruitment? Yeah, they're not bad actually. <laughs> Statue will glow in the dark. <laughs> Oh no. Right, we've got to get rid of that corpse. Like, what the hell? Um, someone get on that. And also, Summer's shut down. Someone needs to fix you. Right, who's my best researcher? Is it Crimson? 17. Yeah. Okay, Crimson. You are going to install the jetpack tech print. I'll give you XP. And you're also going to install the limbs tech print. Ah, oh, now you're 17. Getting a level out of it. Good stuff. Oh, and everyone's happy because they're eating bug goo. What more could you want? Uh, we actually got any sandstone bricks left? Nope. Got any bricks at all? Nope. Oh, shit. Okay. Need a brick. Oh. 30 components just lying around outside. There needs to be a, like a thing for all loot lands somewhere. Oh god, how many are there? When I saw Mad Deer, I thought there'd be one. Jeez, four. Okay. Um, everyone, assemble! actually coming in. Oh, there's more. There's more of them. There's eight now. Um, here they come. That's how you do it. Any more? 
Oh god. The prisoner. The prisoner's gone wild. Take him down, Alpha Cat. Oh fuck it. Use your use your sidearm. Come on. This is your chance for glory, Alpha Cat. Blam. Good work. Badly hurt, is he? Pretty bad. Pretty bad. Um, is that all the deer? No, nope, not quite. Uh, yeah. Any more for any more? All right, shows over people. Time to bring in the rocks. Uh, actually, I think a bit short on rocks. Some more stone chunks from somewhere. Uh, I guess these ones. Another rogue trader, is that right? Is that the same one? Who's another rogue trader? Hope they like brains. Um Right, we've got not really got anything I want so far. Um Gun, gun. They got a little bolt gun. That could be good. Oh, they got a full suit of ultramarine power armor. Seems very cheap. And the servo arm. Take that. Imperial flak plate. Flak plate to attach to most armor. Allows these to decrease the endurance during battle. Just slow them down slightly. Ah. Okay. Oh, but they they want they aren't taking um, some of my other bits. Give me some brains, and give me th three flak plates, and oh, we've, we've got to take a power armor suit, haven't we? And a bolt gun. I've heard that power armor, if you don't have all the Space Marine implants, the power armor is not as good. Uh, which makes sense. Oh, we'll keep the Weber. Oh god, we actually can't afford this. What are we actually buying? Servo arm, power armor, bolt gun, selling a load of crap, and all my brains. Cool. Looks like a good deal. Oh, more of it landed out here. We've got to find a way of fixing this. Why is it throwing all my shit down there? Um, put a roof. Oh, okay. Yeah, that'll probably do, won't it? Um, I can't put a door in the corridor because I think that will mess up the pathfinding. Have a trade beacon outside. Ah, of course. 
I can stick another trade beacon down, can I? Let's put it right here. That makes sense. Makes a little too much sense. Hang on a minute. It's not like us. Oh god, cool Jedi's have just already put the power armor on. Um, it's not for wearing all the time, dude. Um, can't sleep in it. Jeez. I mean, you can put it on when we go on a mission. It's not for every day. He's also grabbed the servo arm. It's not for you either, sir. Um... Let's give it to Izzy, the tech priest. No, I just told you to take it off. There we go. Where'd the power armor go? I've put it on again! Dude! Stop! That can't be classed as worker clothes, surely. Um. Because he's already taken one dink off of it. He's scratched the paintwork. It's not pristine anymore. Cool Jedi, please. Well, we need at least two more regular helmets. Um. Took it out of the packaging. Uh, all right, worker clothes do not include power armor. Um, hmm. God knows where it is. Uh, it's going to be under Imperial. Uh, Imperial armor? There we go. All that. Thank you. Oh god, yeah, we've got to chop all these trees down, haven't we, before we can build a roof. Annoying. Devil Strand's done. Excellent. I think we're going to need hydroponics to grow it in the um, in the winter that's coming up. Have we already got hydroponics? Uh, oh, hospital bed. That'll be good. Here we go. Auto cannon turret. Perfect. Right, we need two of those. So two Imperial components. Someone just nabbed the helmet. Oi! Ollie eats! What are you doing? I, I literally just said that's not allowed. Did you not get the message? Look. Get over here. Take it off. And go back to work. Jeez. Hydroponics is overrated. Just build walls. And a ceiling around a day lamp. Put a heater in the building. Works just as good. Oh, of course. Yeah, I hadn't even thought about that. Okay, that's a good idea. Yeah, we'll just build a little, um, little hot box for the Devil Strand. Um... Do I have people in that wall? I don't think so. No, no, we're fine. Um, yeah, okay, that makes sense. How big is a lamp? Um, what's it count as? Production? Furniture? Sun lamp, there it is. Pretty big. Um, I guess we can stick it over here. And 
plus. Um, get rid of uh, what? And uh, temperature. There's a heater in here. So we need, right? Sun lamps use a lot of power. That's true. They do. Um, let's get like a couple more solar generators, I guess. See how that goes. It's the geothermal vent. Oh. Yeah, I didn't even thought about that. Geothermal. How hot does it get? Like, is, is this enough space? Yeah, you're roofing the geothermal, I, I get that, and then it heats up the whole area. But, is it going to get too hot? Is it going to, like, set them all on fire? Is what I'm worried about. Um, there's only one way to find out. Okay, let's try it out. Let's um, turn off the heater. Um, build a roof over the thermal. And um, stick a vent in. Forty degrees. Forty three degrees. Uh fifty fifty. Okay, seems to be holding steady at forty five. No, it's going up. Hmm. What is it? It's thirty seven outside actually, so in winter this will go down. Oh god, it's still fifty two. What do um kind of temperature does Devil Strand want to be at? Oh, no one's got enough growing skill. Boo. Um, yeah, we'll have to make a bigger grow zone. Um, I don't really have a lot of rich soil. The only rich soil I've got is here. It's a tiny patch. Um, other than that, this is like all I've got. But it's all kind of. This is all kind of irrelevant until someone is good enough with growing. Who are the best growers? No. Oh, we've got a nine. Okay, well, if I just turn everyone else onto less growing, make Izzy do all the growing, they should not take too long. What do they need? 7,000 more XP. This is going to take a while. Oh god, everyone's bored. Jeez, Kurashishi, what are you good at? God, we need to get some more crafting. Crafting happening. Um, has everyone got a helmet now? Ollie, what are you wearing? You're not wearing your helmet. Have we got a helmet for you? Uh, doesn't look like it. 
unless it's in here. No, nope. okay. So we need two more Krieg helmets. And let's just make a bunch of extra components. Um, and auto cannon turrets. Right, yeah, let's. Um, these out of the way. Inquest available. Uh, orbital bombardment targeter. We'll get an... Hmm, buzz for females for five days. It's a pretty good payment though. How many, how many females do we have? One, two, three, four women. Left, just under half. We'll get sad. Oh, excuse me. Oh, well, we can just, like, let them drink beer and stuff for a couple of days, can't we? It'll be all right. I accept. Oh, there we go. Pod's in a better place now. That worked, thank you. Uh, right, so how bad is it? Um, minus 10. Ah, that's right. You can handle minus 10. Okay, so now... Um, there's an autocannon turret. There's an auto cannon turret. And I think we build like a central security station in case anything breaks through. Um, like just right in the middle. We are going to need... Um, God, we're out of ceramite. Jeez, we really are. Okay, where's more ceramite? Shit. Um, really need to find some ceramite. Ah. Oh, that's far away. Oh, visitors. Varacor, Jake, Russ, and Forsane are here. Hello. For me. Medicine, thank you. Components, thank you. Nothing else. Okay, we can have a broken two broken rebreathers. Enjoy. Um two worn out shirts. You're welcome. Some pants. And I guess like generic Rimworld weapons. And a kidney. Thank you. Come again. Got another. Build another thing. Um. Oh, hospital bed's done. Brilliant. Uh. Carapace armor? What does this need? 
It never tells you what it takes to build. That's the annoying thing. So I research something and then I find out, oh, I can't build it. Waste of time. Um... Heavy weapons? Could be fun. There's just so many different weapons added of this mod, it's crazy. Get towards the relic bolter. Where's the relic bolter then? Uh, is it bolt weapons? The Angelus bolter. Where? Is it on the... I don't even know which screen it's on. Uh, oh god, the game's still going. That one. Okay, there, there is a... <laughs> there's a time delay. I'm <laughs> saying that one. Super not helpful. Um, that's the only bolt thing I can see. As I'm being super blind. Uh... Middle of the Astra Militarum screen. Ah, there. I see. Thank you. Um, right, so that needs tier 2 bolt gun, which needs space marine bits, which needs augments, which needs augments, which needs Imperial Apothecary, which needs drug production. That is a long way off. Like, that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 9, 19, uh, 13, 18,000 tech points. Um, oh, it's got 55 range. It's the longest range gun in the game. Um, oh God, it's depressing to start trying to do something that far down the line. Um, but let's just grab mortars quickly before we go down that list and biofuel refining. Then I'll then I'll go for that. Um, yeah, I should do drug production too. Who's a break risk? Alpha Cat. Yeah, they're always a break risk. Um, having a tantrum. Classic Alpha Cat. Dude. It's your own room, you dickhead. I guess that's what happens when you have half a brain. If I only had a brain. Jeez, this is, this is a long, long tantrum. Uh, oh, hang on. Izzy and Cool Jedi have swapped hats. What are you doing? Get over here. Tech priests wear the tech hat. And... Guard, wear the guard hat. There we go. Sorted. Security for a duchess. Um, they want to hide here for 23 days. Um, wow. So many mercenaries. You must keep their mood above 35. Three Yanissaries will come. But you need a bedroom that satisfies the title. Whew. Um, we have got, we've got two researchers. Uh, Jeez. One, two, three, four, ten, fourteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-eight. Jesus, like thirty-three mercenaries. I don't think we can handle that yet. That's going to have to wait. Um, I 
the robot's still running? Yeah. Okay, cool. Right, production. Um, oh, God, we're out of steel again. How, are we, how do we keep running out of everything? I don't feel like I'm even building that much stuff. Wow. Right, what is it? It's 25 degrees in there now. Okay, that's working. Sorry, should have should have been more clear. Please clear it all. Um uh, orders Cutting plants increase your, your growing skill. 3860. No, it does not. Shit. How long left on the monument? We've got um, 16 days. It's going to be fine. Plenty of time. Any of time. Uh, probably pack up my heater. Cool. Everything's going a bit too well. Got some more donuts to read. Um, Komulama donates since his love from Finland. Very much. Uh, Lumanji says, Hello, Bon. I brought the Tao Start collecting box after much deliberation. I haven't based it yet, as I haven't painted in around 12 years. But here's my first shield drone. Compliments and criticism are welcome. Okay. Yeah, I have to say, like, if you don't specifically ask for criticism, I'm never gonna... I'm never gonna do it. Because... Man, painting's hard. You gotta practice. And I don't... You know, if you've got it painted, you, you're done good. And I'm not going to just start telling you, you know, how to make it better unless you really want that. Because I don't think that's very helpful. Um, bam. First drone done. Oh, hang on. Game. Pause game. Um, man, it's pretty cool. I think it looks... Um, the only th Like, for, for criticism, I think you need to thin your paints a little bit. Can you see the... Um, that sort of texture you've got on there, the, like the crinkly bit, I think that's the paint going on too thick. If you get a little bit of water into your paint and try to get it, what I like to do is get it, um, add water until you make a stroke and it starts to shrink. Like you paint it on your palette, you paint the paint onto your palette and then if it shrinks down after you paint it, that means it's a little bit too wet. And then you mix in a tiny bit more paint and then you're good to go. Um, and then um, the end, yeah, just get it on a little bit smoother because it's, it's just kind of dried a tiny bit lumpy. Um, and I reckon once you've got that sorted, you'll be fine. That's a great start, man. I like the like the white, the white rims underneath. It looks cool. Thank you, thank you for sharing your toys. What just happened? It was Kurashishi's in a daze because of the psychic drone. That can't be helped. Um, is anyone else on the edge? Cool Jedi's feeling a bit sad. Oh, they're having a joint. Okay, that'll chill them out. Uh, Walrus is a bit sad. Sad about walrus. Sad about eating paste. We'll get used to it. You're in the guard now. Guard, get paste. Um, right, let's. Oh, 
another structure. No, I don't have time for another structure. Um, Jay Wood donates ten dollars. Thank you, Jay Wood, and says, "Great Bamper, while your organ harvesting setup looks pretty prof profitable, I can't help but think of Balthazar Gelt would do a better job. After all, you could only turn dicks into silver, and he can turn them into gold." <laughs> I know, right? If only, if only Gelt was here to save us. Got to build better doors. Shh. Okay, we got anyone else nearby? Cool Jedi, perfect. Oh, Summers, what are you doing? Get out of there. It's not your job. Thump him with the demon hammer. Bomb. Just cracked him in the leg. Wow, I thought I was going to one-shot him with this thing. Well, they're really, they're really batting it out. Blam! How bad is it? Took a few bruises. He'll be. F oh, it's because he's stoned. That's why he was so bad. <laughs> okay. Cool. Bring him in. Bring him in. Master donates and says, first time hazard stripes. Let's have a look. Uh. Ooh. Oh, I do like this model. Metal looks good. Well, that's a good start, man. I've, I'm not good at hazard stripes, so I can't give you a hard time about it. My hazard stripes always look bad. Because um, the tricky thing is, when you slip on a black stripe, to, to clean it up, you have to get yellow on. But then the yellow doesn't really go over the black. It's really hard to clean it up. I guess the the only way to try and clean it up is to just make it a tiny bit thicker and try to like get another layer of black just to bring in the, the slips. But I'd be pretty happy with it as it is. I do love hazard stripes. It's just something really 40k about them. Nice one, man. Thanks for sharing. Um, Chairperson Lau donates and says, I hereby offer my donation virginity to the Emperor. I've got a your hammer and law hammer for you. Is there a demon world that got dragged away by an armada of space tugs and haulers? Or is there a group of tech priests? That are obsessed with tentacles. Oh my god. I mean, they could both be true, couldn't they? I can imagine a planet getting pulled away by a fleet of tugboats. And I can imagine a fucking hentai tech priest. I'm gonna... I'm gonna pick the, the hentai tech priest. Because <laughs> that's the one I, I prefer. But I have a feeling it might be the other way around. Hey, the monument's complete! Three resurrection serums. Do, 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 do. I'm amazed we haven't had to use one of them yet, actually. All right, now we just got to keep it safe. And keep it secret. I will purge. Oh, hey, Daltos. Thank you for the raid. How are you doing? You here? What were you up to? Were you playing RimWorld 2? Sadly, you are wrong. Check out Temporia on the Lexicarum. Ah, boo. I will check it out. Thank you. Uh, oh, XCOM 2. Nice. Man, I want to go back and play XCOM 2. I saw um, I saw you playing it, and I saw um, Pyrian playing it. And I was like, oh, I haven't played that in ages. It's such a good game. But 
What happened? Did Skunk... What are you doing? Carrying... Oh! Is he joined? He's joined! Oh, Skunk. Welcome. We've been trying to convert him. I thought he was dead for a minute there. Trying to convert him for ages. Um... Right, let's spin the wheel. Oh, it's Faust, isn't it? We said it was going to be Faust. Of course. Super generous Mr. Faust. Faust MD. Thank you, sir. Look at this guy. He's got burning passion for shooting. A burning passion for melee. He's leveled two, two dings of melee while in prison. That's how badass he is. He's got a bloodlust. Um, and he's tough. Takes 50% damage. He's also good at mining and crafting. He's going to be a cold-blooded killer. Um, he's not bad at research either, actually. So what? We need to get him mining and crafting, so he actually practices it. Um, not going to hunt. Well, maybe hunt. Um, cool. We need to find you some good gear, Faust. Um, well, let's see what you choose. Should we make him the rocket man? Someone's got to carry the rocket launcher, right? Um, no, no, sir. No. Power armor is not for you. When I said anything, I didn't I didn't actually mean anything. Um, what's he going for? He's going to put on the Krieg helmet. Oh, that's it. Just the Krieg helmet. Nice. <laughs> Very sexy. <laughs> okay, um, let's make him some clothes, shall we? <laughs> um, jumpsuit, gas mask, trench coat. Perfect. Oh, that's his starter gear on the way. Ah, oh, cool. Cool Jedi's put on his um, put on his light flak armor. Brilliant. He was going to have the hammer too. No, I didn't want to give him the hammer. Um, I wanted Cool Jedi to have the hammer because Cool Jedi has the w uh, wimp trait and the hammer completely negates that. Um, but what's Faust weapons going to be? What's our best melee weapon right now? Uh, Take me into battle. I guess just for now we can give him a, a Gladius sidearm and a long lance. Yes, or a shotgun. Let's try the shotgun. Uh, he's taking his helmet off now. Why? I've got some camels. Um, we've got enough camels. We don't need more camels, guys. Come on. Get out of here. Um, what's this? They want to stay for 15 days. Four refugees, the leader called Sugar. Their house is burnt down and they want to stay here. If you keep them happy, they may stay. Okay. You can stay. Walrus, Sugar, Rep Rep, and Epodax have come to stay. Uh, sure. Welcome. Do we have enough beds? Probably not. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 beds required. Well, this is going to have to turn into not a prison, isn't it? And we've got 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, plus the double bed, makes 9, 10, 11. And three more beds. Oof. Um... Well, temporarily, because you can stay in the hospital. Um, let's get, get a couple more beds in the, the guest house, as we like to call it. Uh, what's with the human body fridge? The corp That's the corpse fridge. Um... Because we need to extract the organs. 
organs are very important to our colony. Um, because we make we make our robots out of human brains. We sold all of our this guy. We've got a little servo skull. It's got a human brain in it. We've got another servo skull over here. It's got a human brain in it. So that's where we keep them. So the brains don't rot. Just don't worry about it. You don't need to go in there. The robots go in there. Stay away. You'll be happy. It's happier to not look. Uh, right, these new guys. Uh, what are they going to be good at? Oh my god, look at that, sugar! You got some stats on you. Um, Epodax, you got some stats. Oh, I'm going to have to get all these assignments. Um, Jeez, okay, this bit's going to get fiddly. Well, obviously everyone fights fires, obviously. And everyone gets medical attention. Um... And then... Wardening, I guess. We don't have any prisoners yet. Uh, cook. Sure, you can cook. Mining, even more important, actually. You'd be chief miner. Uh, Epidex. Really good at very much. Rep, rep. You can cook. What kind of cooking do we want to do? We can make some more survival meals. Actually need those. Do we have a hundred? Uh, oh, what happened to Cool Jedi? Oh yeah, he got into that punching fight. Sure. Is Faust almost over his drug addiction? 82%? Yeah. Cool, not much longer now. Um... Right, is he? Um, how's your plants doing? Jeez, still only 4,000. Okay. Um, just keep keep harvesting and replanting forever. I don't want anyone else doing it. It's all for Izzy. Because they've got to level up to level 10. So we can have some good, good plants. Um. There we go. Perfect. All right, let's get some more mining done too. Where's the rest of that? Uh, here it is. Uh, some components. But there's loads, loads to mine. Okay, I'll keep us going. God, is he? You're just doing everything you can to avoid your plant work. You can eat after you've planted. Get back to it. Um, all right, where was I? I've got some more donos to read out. Uh, Zubal dude donates and says, Great Emperor, my brain was not the part you wanted to save. But Dementia Bot is at your service. Oh, that's why you're such a derpy servo skull. Forgot you had brain damage. <laughs> oh. It's been a long time since we've been attacked. I'm starting to get nervous. Uh, let me update the reader. I've got a few more messages. And then we're going to have to wrap up. I haven't had my dinner yet. I'm getting hungry. Uh, mortars. Excellent. Um, what was the other thing we were going to do next? Oh, uh, biofuel. That was it. Um, security. Mortars. 
battery pop these. Do mortars block um, wind turbines? I hope not. So let's just start with two. Um, Garink donates and says, Hi Ben, Elder Vod Goblin and fan of the XCOM files and Rimworld reporting in from Russia. I don't have time for streams, unfortunately. Thank you for being awesome. Oh, no worries, man. Thanks for, thanks for your dono. Um, also, the put in Sputnik is pronounced Poot. Sputnik, apparently, is the proper Russian pronunciation of that famous satellite. Sputnik. Perfect. What have you sent me here? Uh, oh, XCOM miniature. Where is this from? Is this like a... Um, is this a 3D print? That's cool. Some advent troopers. Oh man, that's cool. I always wanted to play like an XCOM type um, miniatures game. Ah, oh, classic UFO. Oh, I love it. Oh man, that's very cool. What rules are you using? These are not yours. Oh, maybe the link got copied over wrong. These are someone's. Um. Hmm. I don't know how that's happened. Well, thank you anyway. Blue Helix donates and says, Bon, I just finished a project at work so I could tune in. After playing the new Stellaris update, what do you think of it? Oh man, I think it's pretty cool. Changes up the end game a lot. I think if you uh, if you wanted to do another Stellaris playthrough and have like a more complicated end game, check it out. It's very cool. Um, Shumongor donates and says, Hail Bempera, I've been a Vod Goblin and my last donor was lost into the void. But I'm loving the room world. All the model sharing and listening to Warhammer Law vids has made me order my first models. Sky Skaven, yes, yes. Any recommended painting guides and tips? Uh, oh, I really think you should like look for a YouTube video about painting advice because um, it's so much easier to see it happen than to have someone try and explain it to you without pictures. Um, just look for like a painting Skaven tutorial. There'll be a million of them, um, and you'll find one you like. But enjoy, man. Yeah, Sky are really cool. I love the, like, steampunk tech Skaven. They're very fun. Uh, Gammon Joint donates and says, Hello, Ben. I can't watch the stream tonight as I'm as it's back to the grim darkness of retail post-lockdown for me. But have some boys I'm currently fiddling with. Yikes. Yikes, indeed. Luckily, they are tiny toys. So no yikes required. Uh, boop. Oh, nice. Doing some blade guard. Some printed heads. Looks cool. Like the little candles on the guy at the back, too. There he is. Very nice. Oh, nice and grim dork. Alright, send them in when they're painted. I want to see them done. They look very nice. Will I ever play Stellaris on this channel? Maybe. Um, there's a lot of games I want to play, and there's just not enough time. I just don't stream enough to like play all the games. Sadly. Um, rated R Rabbit donates. Thank you. And they say, Bemperer, I missed Wednesday's Warhammer. How could I have known that you streamed on Wednesdays? 
Anyway, ha oh, whoops. Anyway, have my prime and some bucks. I'm still a good two months behind on the reward vods, uh, but really wanted to let you know that I appreciate it. See you soon. Oh, thank you, Rabbit. That's very kind. Enjoy. Uh, Alpha Cat donates and says, Hello, Star King Ben. I feel like my character has qu had quite a transformation with the, s with the sword from the sword-wielding grenade-throwing maniac to the colony sad dro <laughs> drooling mascot. Warm regards, peasant Alpha Cat. I know, he's really had quite the, uh, quite the arc, hasn't he, old Alpha Cat? I'm sure we'll fix him one day, though. He won't be broken forever. We'll find a way. Life finds a way. You know? He'll be alright. One day. Uh, what do we want? We want... Where are they? Shelves. That's the one. And I think I can leave shelves outside with mortars in the shell. Mort with the shells in the shelves, and they won't deteriorate, hopefully. Uh, let's get some more organs while we're at it. Why's no one... Why's no one getting the organs? No material. Oh shit, these must all be too old. Boo! Thought I kept them nice cool. They're not cool enough. Damn. What are we going to do with all that... All that human meat now? Shit. Oh, it's getting cold now. Zero degrees outside. Uh, one's doing all right. All right, I need to get some more rock creep as soon as we get a chance. What's your beef? Why are you so sad? Psychic drone. Yeah, that drone's got to go away soon, right? Um, ah, finished by refining. Perfect. Um, what was next? Alright, then we're going to go for the, for the drug production, wasn't it? Uh, that's it. Okay, where are we going to make the fuel, fuel machine? Um... I don't really know where to store the fuel either. Oh, no, hang on. Hang on, guys, you got this all wrong. Um, we're not storing anything in here except mortar shells. And it is top priority. Okay, uh, that's not blocking that. Perfect. Um, right, what was I doing? God, I keep forgetting what I'm doing. I'm getting too tired. I need to, to wrap things up. Notice the text beside your pictures. Oh, okay, let me go back to them. Sorry, Gark. I've been distracted. Uh, where are they? Uh, oh, yeah, no, you have been. Yeah, sorry, it does, all the questions I asked are answered in the text. Yeah, they were 3D printed, XCOM boys. Uh, 
using all the zombies on the shelf. The rules are heavily inspired from 40k. The main stat checks are based on that. The system streamlined somewhat. Well, I should hope so. I find 40k like a super bloated um, rule set. So good to hear that you streamlined it. Oh man, that looks really fun. The old XCOM minis game. Good for you. It's always nice to see people like just making their own thing. I like it a lot. Robot trader. Uh, looks like we need at least two more. Two more trench coats. Where do they keep going? Who's eating all my trench coats? I feel like I just keep making them and needing more. Why is Faust naked? I don't know why Faust is naked. Ask Faust. I keep telling him to put clothes on. Um, he just won't. Where's the jumpsuit, anyway? I'm pretty sure I told them to make a jumpsuit. Extreme break risk. Uh, Faust is about to lose his mind. because he's having withdrawal, and he's hungry, and he's cold, and he's naked. Dude, all of these things are your own fault. Sort it out. Eat. Put some clothes on. Um, someone finished making his clothes for him. Oh, the um, robot trader. Oops, totally forgot. Um, all right, what have you got for me? I could buy another service goal for four grand. Uh, how many? How many kidneys is that? Trade you? Trade you 12 kidneys for a server skull? Uh, yeah, why not? Uh, where should we put it? Put it in here as well. Uh, right, we still need to make that chemical chem lab, right? Um, okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to call it there. I need to go and have my dinner. But it's been a uh, shockingly productive stream. I can't believe how much we've got done. Like, holy moly. Oh, soon we'll get Faust some clothes. Okay, I need to get, I wanna get him some clothes right now. Let's, um, let's get him back inside. Well, oh, no. He really wants to dig. Let's put you on um, party time. Uh, Faust, party all day. Everything's okay. You'll be okay, dude. Don't worry. No, he really just wants to dig. Look at him go. No matter what I do, he needs to dig. Um, why would he do recreation? Oh, because it's four in the morning. Okay, we 
Are you just a party, party non-stop kind of guy then? Uh, drug production complete. Imperial apothecary. And means drug lab. Okay, with a lovely chat. Yeah, I know I should give them decent food. It's just in the beginning, you don't have the man hours for it. And now we're getting into the mid game. I guess we probably can give them proper food, can't we? Oh god, are they they're using insect meat? No, don't. Oh my god. Don't use the insect meat, guys. Please. Oh, for the kibble. That's all right. You can use it for kibble. Um, Faith is our shield. We could we could try switching him onto simple meals. See how that goes. Uh, right, simple for everyone. See how that goes. See if we've got got enough for that. Um, no eating the pemmican or the survival meals. Need those for trips and adventures. And we need uh, chem fuel made out of. Um, Insect meat. Where is it? It's bizarre that you can turn insects into chem fuel, but I'm not going to complain because I need it. There we go. And we can make. Oh. Drugs labs. I thought you could make medicine here. Is that a different tech? Yeah. Yeah, it is a different tech. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, right, what do we got? Woo! We, look at that. Look at that map. It is covered in drop pods and everyone, oh my god. This is a disaster. This might be the end of Kurashishi and, and Kavi. They're just getting drop podded immediately. Jesus. Uh, the Moss had asked, did you get my sub message? Uh, I don't remember reading it out. Let me scroll back. Um, uh, no, sorry, I didn't read it out. Uh, the Mossad says, uh, subscribes and says, It's been a rough few days. My dog died. People going cold at me at work. But it's getting better because it's happy birthday for my country. Thanks for all the streams. They brighten my week. Oh man, Mossad, I'm sorry to hear that. Well, happy country birthday. Have a fun time. And um, yeah, it's always like, man, any pet dying is just rough as hell. And um, I hope you feel better soon. Man. Um, a sad note to end the stream on. Oh, look, they're all going down here. It's not so bad. I thought they were going to drop one over here. Um. So, everyone, come back. We might be alright. Yeah, yeah, we're going to be okay. We can fight this off. What are they? Oh my gosh! <laughs> um, 22 fire warriors have landed. Got a mixture of pathfinders, fire warriors, carbines, pulse rifles... Burst? Some of them have got burst cannons. Holy shit. Okay. Well, that's the cliffhanger to leave it on, I think. Come back next week to see if we can survive the Tau Apocalypse. Um, let's see if they use the kill box and if these new auto cannon turrets are, um, are the business or not. Yeah, this is a problem for future Ben. If 
Fuck that guy. Um, I'm gonna go get some dinner. That's what. That's what. That's what present Ben's gonna do. <laughs> well, thank you all for watching. Thanks for coming. Thanks for uh, donating and subscribing and just being generally cool, fun guys to hang out with. I've had a good time. I'll be back next week. I'll be doing Warhammer on the Yogscast channel on Wednesday, and I'll be doing this on Thursday. Uh, let's raid someone, shall we? Um, who we got? Who's around? Um, oh, not many people. Most everyone's offline. We got um, Pyrians playing Dota. G's playing Minecraft. Um, high rollers at high rolling. Mousy's playing Dead by Daylight. Mango's playing CSGO. I don't know what you fancy. Where do you want to go? <laughs> Zoro's doing Throg. Like a lot of people want to go for G. That sounds cool. I think G's streaming with Simon. Which is always fun. Go check out G and Simon. Do Minecraft. And um, have a lovely night. I will see you next week. And obviously if you want to go see any of the other people, go for it. Go check them out instead. Have fun. See you later. Bye.